Hello. Good afternoon. Good morning. Good evening. Wherever you are in this vast world. How is everybody today? Oh, I You guys, this internet is terrible. Hi, Susie. How are you? Um, sorry about the internet. Our weather, what's up, Scooter? It's just, good God, our internet is terrible, you guys. Our weather, man, we still have ice, and I'm pretty sure that um, that's the reason that our uh, fucking internet is garbage right now. Pay all that money for high-speed business internet, and this is what you get. And it's absolutely uh, crazy. Well, good, Susie, if you're relaxing. You should relax. Salute. You should relax. So we get some people on here. We got some stuff. Yeah, Grunge, I, I'm telling you, they do this shit on purpose. I have Xfinity. Business. We pay between the internet and the alarm two hundred fucking fifty six dollars or two hundred and fifty eight dollars a month, man. It's fucking ridiculous. You know, we have internet, we have cable, we have the alarm system, we got lights. Oh my god. Costs a damn much. It's, but anyways, we going to do. But seriously, what are we going to do? We could pray about it. Because, you know, Rick hates witches, according to some people. <laughs> oh, I guess I hate witches now, you guys. I didn't know that, but. Oh, I swear to God, every time I wake up, that fucking bukia over there, that dumb fuck has something stupid to say about me and, you know. But it's okay to drive a child around stoned, methadone, and all fucked up. That's okay. That's what we refer to as normal behavior. So... What I do and Sue and Susie and Grunge and all you guys, what we do, we the devil, according to some people. Uh, hi, Sherry. Yes, see um, how I'm making, I'm making your court candle for protection tonight. <laughs> oh, hi, Barb. 504. I mean, come on. Happy Sunday, guys. You guys, let's be honest. One person opens her fucking dumb trap who has nothing better to do but to talk about white people. You should, I, you know what? Bro, you're right. And I, we're not going to say a whole lot today, and then I am going silent. Because there's shit that's going behind the scenes. And I can tell you guys this. Hi, Lisa. Hi, LOL. Barb, Tom, Chicken, Susie, Sherry, LOL. But I can tell you this. And I've said this before. And this is how it is. Motherfuckers that fuck with me directly, indirectly, that have I trash, to have other people do this. You motherfuckers better pray to God that I don't get a hold of people that actually care about that have jobs and homes. Oh, her superiority complex is ridiculous. But, hey, Rocky, what's up? But I can tell you this. Fuckers that they care about, when they start losing jobs and, and a bunch of stuff, it's going to all lead back to controller. 
So all this fucking shit's funny, right? Ha, ha, ha. Everybody laughs. It's funny. Um, you know, we're, we're going to see how funny stuff is. When fuckers start losing jobs, maybe homes, and a lot of shit, because you're fucking with me. <clears throat> you guys keep laughing. Keep calling me a white supremacist and all that stuff. Because all it does is fuel me and I probe and I dig deeper and deeper. And finally, Carissa, D. Lynn, Lisa Stewart, and Alexandria, your pig ass. When people that you care about lose jobs and homes, you're going to fucking see what the fuck goes down. Of course I'm hitting nerves. Oh, of course I am. It's not real, Mr. Oh, yeah, of course not. Of course I'm hitting nerves. You know why? I'm going to tell you guys why. Number one, you guys. Um, what is it? Hold on a minute. Let me see. Uh, yeah, that's just about them dumbasses. Guys, I'm telling you. I'm I'm done. But I'm going to keep quiet because I've been talking to people. And they're going to fucking see. And there ain't enough. Scotty, hey, cheers. Salute. They're not going to. Listen. When people they care about start losing jobs. And guys, let's be honest. Okay. Uh, Alexandria. Her family dumped her canned her ass like tuna, okay? She has nobody. She's trying to tell me she's never been on government assistance. So what I think is funny about Carissa and Alexandria and all these fat, nasty pigs like D. Lynn and all that. Oh, you say stuff one time without proof, and boom, we're supposed to just automatically believe it. There is so much shit online that that's <laughs> too dangerous. Yeah, Rocky, it's too dangerous. It ain't fucking dangerous. Listen, bro, you've got to know me long enough. Anax, what's up? Uh, oh, you're welcome. You guys know that motherfucking I ain't backing down from Jack and shit. We've already confirmed again, you guys. There's no warrants. There's no nothing. Carissa talks. Her little puppet over there, the little black puppet over there, or whatever the fuck Alexandria is. Exactly. The 128. What's up? You guys are full of shit. And I hope to God, okay, you guys? And I'm talking to Trisha and Grunge and Rocky. Now. I hope them motherfuckers truly, truly don't think that I'm in contact with the lead detective. I really hope they don't believe that. That's number one. Just drinking vodka. All right, man. I'm just having me some, some beer. Hi, Billy Kay. How are you? Yeah, Billy. Real, real shit. Not as bad as slander from multiple websites, yeah. Cheers, salute, tin towel. 100 years. Um, so, I found out a lot of stuff. And then I learned something. That there's so many little fucking ears. Um, oh, the slander, yeah. Well, guess what, grunge? And I'll say this to you, Grunge, because I like you. If Carissa and, hi, Lisa, if Carissa and Alexandria, that pig, wants to call my boss, it's 1-800-GO-FUCK-YOUR-MOTHER. So, yeah. I, it's so funny that, okay, first of all, you guys, Control of Carissa is not a Wiccan. Okay? 
Yeah. Um, what's up, Gish? So, Alan, what's up? So, that's the first thing. This fucking delusional crackhead doesn't have powers. Number one. She's not a witch. There are Wiccans that I talk to. Yeah, she's a wicked witch. And Trisha, let me tell you something about Alexandria. She's still mad because somebody dropped the house on her sister. Fucking bookie up piece of shit. But don't worry, Alex. Don't click on any of the devil sites. They're IP grabbers. Yeah. I don't go. I'll be honest with you guys. I don't watch uh, Alex. I know what she says when she posts stuff and then her, pay, her, her page. She watches me right there, you fucking piece of shit. I got your ass. Um, But I don't watch her. I've never watched one of her videos. Never. Because I'll tell you why. The that pig piece of shit has nothing to say. It's the same crap. And I did some. Yeah, I will, Barb. I'm gonna let Barb on in. I'm gonna talk for a little bit, Barb. Of course, she records it. And guess what? She can go fuck her dad, Ivan. Oh, that's right. She already said. That her mom and dad were child groomers. And guys, this fucking pig piece of shit has been stalking and fucking people for over 10 years. But I'm going to tell you guys something that she's not going to do. That piece of shit in Houston, Texas ain't fucking with me. The only thing she can do, okay, is type little bullshit and talk shit about me. That's all she can do. That's all any of them can do. Because the minute her fucking piece of shit comes here, it's your fucking ass. I know she's a fraud, Scotty. Listen, she's a welfare dick son, uneducated, no job, dumb fuck. She is the most racist pig. But when she opens her mouth, and she talks and she calls people white, white, yeah, I was gonna say white supremacists. Come on, in a little bit, yeah. What she does is she race baits, number one. I mean, people have, I've been reading about her. I'm going back as far as 2015 about her ass. Okay, that's number one. Number two, she is fucking with my son. So we have an actual report on her for being racist and trying to solicit my son. She can lie. It doesn't matter. Yeah, she's encouraging people to report Skelly, but you guys, that shit doesn't work. You got to head motherfuckers like her head on. Okay? Alex said, these people do lives all day for money. They don't have real lives, pathetic. Told him your daughter does lives and drinks. Yeah, so, so INX actually talked to um, Alex's dad. And I'm going to tell you guys something. Ivan and Joanne and Victoria and any motherfucker that's associated with Alex. You better pray to God they don't have good jobs. Cause we... Hey, that dude, why don't you go fuck your mother? You got it? Why don't you stop with all that ghetto talk and go blow your dad, that dude? Don't fucking call me them black names, you fucking piece of shit. Go fuck your mother. What do you think of that? That dude. Fuck you gonna do? Oh, that's right. Nothing. So you get to go fuck your dad. You fucking piece of shit. See, that's all you guys got. That's all you got. L. Frost, what's up? Ciao, how are you? That's all. You can't do nothing. You can keep making these stupid ass, oh, oh, Italian guy. That's it. 
we're close on your ass, real close. Hey, what's popping? How are you? Uh, INX said she's talked to Ivan twice, and he's dying of cancer. Not and not do. Well, hold on, guys. Oh, God. Okay. So, um, but guys, I have found so much. Now, you guys, oh, we're having a good weekend, Frost. How are you? What's popping, robot? Tommy James. Yeah, freezing up. I'm sorry, you guys. I mean, literally, we've had ice, that it's been okay, that it's snowing. It's fucking weird. But guys, I learned something talking to some of you guys and having people check in and stuff. I'm done saying what we're going to do. Just going to fucking do it. But I can tell you guys, when motherfuckers, she actually gives a fuck about lose jobs Try to lose homes, you're going to know why. And I'm going to say this for Controla. Since Big Mouth Controla can't fucking stop, she made a. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. How are you? Um, can I post my email? Best way to contact you. Um, yeah, we don't. Um, really have a hi Pam we don't really have an online store I you know I need to stop Sammy what the fuck do I need to stop yeah why don't you go fuck your mother because I'm not stopping shit I'm going fucking harder now yeah fat neck oh you think that hurts yeah look at that fucking neck yeah Woo -wee. that sure is you ain't doing shit Sammy you get to go fuck your dad I'm going after hard. But guys, what I was going to say, Lisa, you can reach out to me on Instagram and um, fat washed up idiot. Is that all you got, Sammy? Because you hide. You hide because you're a pussy just like your friends. But because of people like you, Sammy, because of people like you, you guys see this? You guys know what this is? Yeah, I'm going to wash your fucking ass, motherfucker. You got, you're going to see, Sammy, when I get your friends' jobs and parents fucking fired and lose homes, you're going to fucking see. Oh, grunge, I know. But let me tell you something. You guys know what this is? So this right here is transfer paper. So I want Sammy and all you motherfuckers do. Guess what, Sammy? You're a fucking cunt. You get to go fuck your dad. Wow. You hurt. You can't do anything? We're going to see, Sammy. Because of you, I'm going to take it out on Alex. I'm going to take it out on Carissa. When I get her stepdad and people fired because of people like you, you're going to see, bitch. Yeah, Candy, they don't fucking know. I bet you Sammy's a fat pig. That's why they hide. But anyways, that paper is transfer paper. I'm making t-shirts with Controller's face on it and Alex's face. Next time I go live, I'm going to have it. I'm going to show you. And we are going to sell them. And there ain't a motherfucking thing you can do. And guess what, Sammy? You're a fucking cunt. Oh, really? Well, good, motherfucker. I'm going to drop the link. I'm going to drop the link right now, you fucking piece of shit. Yeah. Yup. Here you go, Sammy. You fucking piece of shit. Here, let me see your fucking face. There you go, motherfucker. Hop on, bitch. Fat lard. Yeah, yeah. Fat fucking lard. Fat lard that'll fuck all you people up. Yeah, yeah. A fat motherfucker that'll fuck all you people up. 
They're not doing shit. Watch. That Sammy ain't doing shit. All they do is this. You fuckers can't do nothing to me. Yeah, that's all it is. Might porn bomb you. Come on, Sammy. I am going to threaten you, you motherfucker, because you ain't doing nothing. I'll bitch slap the fuck out of you, too. You ain't doing shit. Where are you? How come you didn't show your face? I'm washed up. When your friends get fired and I fuck with their families, it's on you, bitch. You, motherfucker. You're going to see. Oh, you're going to see. Because I'm going to be in Jersey. Why was crazy Crystal badmouthing you yesterday? I only caught. Oh, I have no. Hi, Lindsay. I have no idea. Oh, my God. I I have no idea. I haven't talked to Crystal Ann in months. My memorabilia is fake. <laughs> yeah, that's why I got certification for all of it. You fucking see what I'm saying? You're a pussy. You're on food stamps. You're fat as fuck. You're a disgusting pig like your friends. You can't do nothing. Hop on, Sammy. You said you were coming on. Come on, motherfucker. Come on. There's the fucking link. Yeah. That's what I thought. Oh, I know. I I know about her. Yeah, you see what I'm saying, Lisa? Where are they? Where are they? Jeremy, that Freddy Krueger sweater right there was Jackie Earl's Haley. Yeah, I did it this time, Sammy. Come fuck with me. Because you motherfuckers fucked up. You fucked up. Because I'm going to fuck with all you motherfuckers. And when I'm in Jersey, you bitches ain't doing shit. You want to come to Jersey and see me? Fucking come see me. Because we got more motherfuckers coming. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Only control his fans have a hard time spelling their own insults. Come on with it. Oh, yeah, it was Waze. You know, it's so funny, Tom. And I laugh my ass off when you say that. Come on. You keep talking. You're a pussy. Go fuck your dad, you fucking piece of shit. Exactly, Scotty. All show. Bunch of pussy cowards. You know why? Because they're all fat, bloated, nasty, scumbag welfare recipients. But I'm going to be there in Jersey and nobody's doing shit. Mm, yeah. And I'm naked t shirts, you guys. Of course, they're a, co a coward. Ain't nobody doing nothing. Look at old fat neck over there. Oh, yeah, old fat neck. You're going to fucking see, motherfuckers. Yeah, yeah. so her court date, March 20th, 9 a.m., room 504, as Tom says. Okay? Where are you at, Sam, you fucking pussy? You're a fucking coward. That's all you guys got. You got nothing because you ain't going to do shit. When I'm in Jersey, motherfuckers are going to sit and take it. When I pass my flyers around, to Starbucks and everywhere, you're going to take it. It's all chub. Is that all you got? Little little school ground. Oh, 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 little school. Uh. How's it feel, Sammy, to know that you blow your own father with that mouth? You fucking pussy coward. You ain't doing nothing. This is all you can do. Guys, how scary is it? That some Sammy fake comes in here, oh, and they talk. You ain't doing nothing. I guarantee you, your piece of shit ass ain't fucking going to Jersey. They're not coming up. I mean, I've sent the, uh, here, I'll send the leak one more time. And then and it is what it is, you guys. There it is again. What is this, the fourth fucking time? Wow. Control is the fat motherfucker. Grunge, it's okay. You know why? Yeah, chicken. Grunge, let me tell you something. Just so everybody's crystal clear. 
Oh, I know, I know. I, you know I don't give a fuck. Let me tell you what you motherfuckers don't know. Sammy, pay attention, you stupid fuck, because you got fucking fat in your ears, you fucking pig. I'm going to be in Jersey. They already know everything about Chris and what she's doing. They know about people like you, Sammy, who threaten people for control of. Okay? Don't know who old Randall McCoy is. Have no idea who that is. So you motherfuckers ain't popping on unless you show a face. Show a face, and then your ass can come on. Other than that, you ain't coming on because you're a bunch of coward pussy. So they have Alexandria's picture. Hey, Barry. Um, They got her picture. Yeah, of course Sammy's hiding because they're a bunch of pussies, Michelle. They don't want none, and they ain't going to do none. And I can tell you this. None of them, none of them are going to be, hey, Melissa, at her hearing. You know why? Because they don't want nothing. They ain't doing shit. Nothing. They're going to sit and take it like good little lab rats. You know goddamn well, you guys. Let's be honest. Okay? Hi, Drama. How are you? Yeah. Sending an attack dog. Bunch of pussies. But I'll tell you what you are going to do when I'm down there. You're going to shut your fucking mouth. Snow White, hey. How are you? And you're not going to do nothing. That's all, Jeremy. Ain't nobody doing nothing. When I'm there at court, when I'm selling t-shirts with Carissa's fucked up face and Alexandria's face, you're going to do nothing. Thing. You're going to take it like a man. When I make money off my t-shirts, and what I'll do, you guys, is we'll do, I mean, this is too busy for a t-shirt. Okay, meme start the show. This is too busy for a t-shirt. But when I when I start nailing and pasting them motherfuckers everywhere, and nobody's doing nothing. When I go, when I go to the methadone clinic, nobody's doing nothing. Nothing. You're gonna fucking take it because you can't do nothing. Where's Sammy at, you fucking pussy coward? You're gonna do nothing. Because you can't do anything. Alexandria, you're fucking psychotic ass. You're doing nothing. So, um, it could be, it could be. Um, but you know what I think is funny? Is all these uh, fucking idiots... are doing nothing, nothing, not a fucking thing. You're going to take it like the good little bitch lab rats. Oh, yeah. When you see me in court, you're going to keep your fucking mouth shut and go the fuck away. Oh, Snow White, they're going to know. Don't listen. Let me say this to you guys. Oh, Alexandria's still obsessing me over. I mean, do you blame her? I fit the profile. Nice looking white guy. Got some stuff. She ain't got shit. Nothing. Nothing. You know that. Uh, but isn't that funny? I got a little guy, a little gay in me, really, Jumbo? You know what I think is funny? How come you pussies come in here under fake accounts like you're tough? Seriously, why don't you come up and say it? Here. Mr. Bo Dilly, 
What the fuck kind of Fenoic name is that? There's the link. Why don't you bring your ass up here and say it to my fucking face? Yeah, Barb said uh, Alexandria has the hots. What's up? There you go. Yeah, it is. Like I said, guys, I'm so sorry. Um, we, we've had ice storms and that, and um, but I'm right here, motherfuckers. But you notice, you guys, you notice, none of them do nothing. They talk. Hey, Nancy, what's up? Hey, Purple Buds, salute. But let's, you guys, let's be honest. Yeah, yeah, we're still in ice storm. But let's be honest. I talk, I talk loud. Because I can back my shit when I have to. Snow White, yeah, I'm, I think so. Ways broadband, thanks, Tom. <laughs> it's just, it's just bad. With the um, couple minutes. You ready? Okay. Sue's gonna come on. Sue's got stuff to say, and I'm gonna have Barb come on. So, guys, um, yeah, Candy, she really is a. I mean, do you, you guys, do you blame her? Call me. I'm not fat. Where, where am I fat at? I know, you guys. I am a tad out of shape, you guys. Listen, nobody ever said I was Mr. Macho Wacho. Never said it. Never said I was the toughest guy on the block. But, yeah, Nancy, because... Uh, Barb's going to talk about being a Wiccan since that piece of shit Alex is stalking and fucking with me about witchcraft. So yeah, Barb's going to say shit about um, um, about Wiccan and all that. So, um, but guys, honest to God, never said in a million years I was the toughest guy in the block. But I know this. I know what I do and I don't do, and I know what I can and can't do. Um, fear the neck. <laughs> hey, listen, I'm I'm in the mood to pick a fucking fight, you guys. And when I go to Jersey, okay, I'm gonna fucking be honest. Okay, Barb, in a little bit. Or here, what, hey Sue. Do you want Barb to go on first or do you want to? Come here. Hold on a minute, Barb. Um, hold on a sec, you guys. I'm gonna I'm gonna figure out. You're gonna send the Pope Alex's way, Alan. Yeah. I'm gonna find out if Sue wants to talk and then Barb or Barb and then Sue. But guys, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm ready to pick a fucking fight with any of these motherfuckers. Okay? Peacefully protesting. Okay. Barb, I'm going to have someone first, and then I'm going to have you because she's going to talk about the whole Wiccan thing and the whole, you know. Um, but I'm going to say this. We are going to peacefully, peacefully, listen to me, Protest at the courthouse. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to peacefully protest at the courthouse. If any of you motherfuckers want to start some shit apps after, I'm more than happy to oblige any of you fucking people. But I can guarantee you, as we sit here, guys, one thing is, Barb, Sue's going to talk, and I'm going to have you on. Let me tell you what we do know. 
Carilla ain't fucking jacking shit. She ain't cold cocking nobody. She ain't doing nothing. She's going to walk the fuck by me like I'm not there. I'm not going to say shit unless she tries something. Other than that, I got the mouth of a statue. Okay? That's number one. Number two. D. Lynn. Lisa Stewart. Fucking Alexandria. Sammy. All them motherfuckers. Not one of you pussy cowards is going to be there. Nobody. And you fucking know why. Because you know, if you get in my space, you know what the fuck's going to go down. Everybody's already on alert. You guys are stupid. The fucking Middlesex County Court. They already know. They know every... Listen, you guys, I'm going to tell you straight up. Every single thing Alex says indirectly with Controller and Carissa, it all gets forward. And it ain't just by me. Oh, Snow White, you guys are welcome. Because I'm tired of it. Yeah, I'm a can of motherfucker like tuna. And I keep telling people, the more Alexandria fucks with us, the more we're going to fuck with them. And sooner or later, we're going to get to somebody that that psycho bitch cares about. And when they start losing jobs, homes, and a lot of shit, hi, Flowers, fuck all you motherfuckers. You think I just sit idle and I don't say nothing. I want you to think that. I want you guys to think, oh, he's a loudmouth idiot. He don't do nothing. Cloud Skate, not going to win. But you guys, this is a win for anybody that's been fucked with by Carissa, anybody that's been stalked and harassed by Alexandria, D Lynn, your big ass, Lisa Stewart. Lisa's got a good job. Boy, it'd be a shame to see your ass get fired because you run your fucking mouth. That's how it goes. You want to call my boss, 1-800-GO-FUCK-YOURSELF. Nice guy. You guys open a can of worms with me. Controller, I told you and Jacinda, that pig, uh, dragonflies. You better tell fucking Alexandria to put a muzzle on that fucking bitch. But no, she thinks it's funny to call people white supremacists. Right. So you're going to see, bitch. You're already got timed out typing 504 in the chat. No, you didn't. Not by me, you didn't. Tom, I don't, I'm not going to time you out, bro. You could say whatever you want here. I don't like censorship, you guys. Tom, you can say whatever the fuck. Right, Lisa. 1-800-GO-FUCK-YOUR-MOTHER. That's Sue's boss. Mm -hmm. Nice guy. Yeah. Um, You guys are going to see. Oh, you were in her chat. You got timed out. Yeah, because they're cowards, Tom. They're cowards. But they're going to see because the, the people that are working behind the scenes and I'm not talking about INX and them. I'm talking about people you fucking people don't even know that are working on info, jobs, house, all kinds of shit. That's it. You can laugh. You can call me short, or ugly. You think I care? You guys, let me tell you something about... Um, when people talk about size or height, when you've never been tall, you don't miss it. Who cares? But I tell you this, you want some. When I'm in Jersey, you can have all you want. All you got to do is come up to me, get like that and confront me. It's all you got to do. I'll handle the rest. Then you can and say, wow, that little short guy, he stuck that foot so far up my ass. <laughs> oh, yeah. You'll fucking see. But I guarantee 
as all you guys stand here, not one motherfucker is going to confront me at court. Not one. Not anybody. Especially not Gary, not Charles, not none of them motherfuckers. And remember, guys, Controller said she's got yo-yo, whatever that means, rolling up. Yeah, so do I. Yeah, Grunts, they don't understand about lower uh, gravity. They don't understand. Yeah. Fuck with me and find out. Get in my space. All you got to do. You only got to do it once. <laughs> Come on, Susan. She got some shit to say. Okay, the old lady's back because I've been called old, 50 years old. Hey, Alex. She's been called old. Do you guys say this a fucking wig? It's all mine. Oh, yeah, except the hair don't come out. <laughs> fucking pigs. I'm Russian Romanian. We have very thick hair. It's the way it goes. Don't guys are jealous. I'm going to tell you, Alex, because I know you're... Michelle said hi. Everybody said hi. Hello. So I'm going to tell you, Alex, because you've been stalking me. You have absolutely been stalking me. I know for a fact you're the one who's reached out to people. You've been stalking everything about me, bitch. And you know what? I'm going to put this straight forward as can be because you're watching this right now. You're pretending a game and you're on one of your fake accounts watching us right now because you're obsessed. How corny. Because you're obsessed with him. And you know what the problem is, Alex? So Do you blame him? Why, no. why you, you fuck with me? Oh, Barry Hodge, Russian Romanian, too. Oh, hello. Love our Russian Romanian people. So, so this is what Alex, you like to call everybody racist? You dumb twat. If you forgot, I'm Jewish. We're not racist people because we know what hatred's like. So, you know what the real problem is with you, Alex? Whatever the fuck your name is? Is that Cash you, the, you, this goes back years with you where you absolutely hate white guys. And the reason being is that. For so long, you tried to get with the white guys, the good-looking white guys, and they didn't want you. And that's where your hatred started years ago. Yes, I know. Because of girls like me that got those guys that you wanted, and they didn't want you. This is why you go after every girl on here. You go me, you've gone after Trisha, you've gone after any girl that's pretty. Because you're jealous because those guys never wanted your ass. And they wanted girls that look like me and Trisha and other girls. I need to see. And let's be fucking honest. These people do not want you, never did want you. You have a fucking crush on him. I've already been told this by numerous people. And I'll tell you this much, bitch, he do not control me. Like you said, well, oh, she sits on his lap. She controls me. Oh, I'm a bitch. I, <laughs> you got an Italian and a Jew. Hello, good fellas going on. But seriously, this is what couples do, Alex. They sit on the other one's lap. This is what normal, healthy couples do, which we are. We're a typical normal couple. I'm not his fucking roommate. Oh, she have crazy eyes. I'm not his fucking roommate. We own this house together 50-50. We bought it together. I would say that's more than a roommate, Alex. Oh, here comes Sammy. Oh, hold on one minute, guys. That's important. Tell her she's welcome. Okay. Sorry, guys, that's my ma. We, I put groceries and stuff um, on her deck. Oh, that's right. I take care of my mother, and I just put a bunch of groceries and stuff at her door for her. What's the matter, Sammy? Is that all you got? Yeah, Sammy, is that all you got? How can you uh, pull off a wig when it's real hair? Sammy. You got one more shot, you fucking disease-infected pig, to come up here. Oh, my God. That's her real hair. Been... Yep, I did. Sure did, bitch. Jealous. Oh, poor Sammy. You're a piece of shit. And you know what I heard about you, Sammy? I heard you like to fuck your dad. Wow, you sickle. Did you guys know that that Sammy? That's Controller's friend. They were talking in Controller's chat about how her dad used to fondle her. And she's all upset. Wow. Why don't you go get some help, Sammy? Because your dad used to touch you. Go get help. Don't sit here online and, you know, 
try to be tough with us. Yeah, let's hear it. They, they ain't coming on here. There's the link again, Sammy. You know what the difference is? You're a fucking piece of shit that blows her dad with that mouth. Of course, she's a diddler, Philip. But she already, you guys, so Sammy already cried and broke down a controller because her daddy was touching her. <laughs> fat neck. Yeah, look at the fat neck, guys. Look at that. Oh, fat neck. I know. Isn't that ridiculous? <laughs> oh, I'm not changing the subject. Um, oh, poor Sammy. Does your dad still touch you, Sammy? Listen, you guys. You guys should feel bad for Sammy. <laughs> she likes to fuck her dad. She was telling Controlla that her dad comes in her room at night and touches her and her sister. But you obviously like it, Sammy. Wow. You're okay with that, dude? She made a video on me, too. Oh, did she? Hey, Julia, how are you? That's disgusting, Sammy. And listen, talking to Carissa about your father touching you and your sister, listen, she can't help you. Get it through your fucking crack head. She's not a therapist. You got to go see a real therapist. Okay? Go get help, Sammy. What's popping? You seem pressed, NDL, and I don't know either of you. Who Who's pressed? Purple Buds, who's pressed? No, that's not a different Sammy. That's you, asshole, because I've seen you in Controller's chat. The purple woman, you're a fucking liar. You see, oh, okay, Barry. Um, Sue, grab my phone, Barry. Thank you. Um, that's my mom. I just brought my mom a bunch of groceries. But, Barry, thank you. No, that's you, Sammy. Oh, that's you. See how they get mad? Read that comment that that Sammy just said. It's not a different Sammy. It's you. You were getting fucked by your dad. He was touching you and your sister, and you were telling controller. Oh, poor Sammy. What's the matter, Sammy? You don't have nobody to go to. You got no friends. You got to come in my chat because you got nothing. You got nothing, bitch. You get fucked by your fucking dad, you and your sister. Hey, motor mouth, guess what? It's not me. It's fucking them. That's true. She was already talking to controller. And if you don't like it, don't give a fuck what you fucking like. Sorry. These guys want to see me. Hi, duck. <laughs> yep. There's the fat neck. Guys, listen. I don't give a fuck. Sammy knows it's her. Sammy knows what she confided to Controller. Oh, my dad. Oh, oh. You don't go to Controller when there's incest in the fucking house. Who the fuck does that? You think that fucking pig from Staten Island's going to help you? Um. Oh, I duck. I thank you. You too. Julia, thank you. Um, Sammy's upset because she just got outed and they don't like it. Oh, Purple Haze is a sativa, yeah. Oh, that's all right, Amber. You, you're good. We're going to ride on this till nine o'clock. We're going to go on for a little more than an hour because we actually have some stuff we have to take care of. We got a bunch of stuff tomorrow. But yeah, Sammy, don't be mad at me. Oh, don't be mad at me because, because your daddy, you guys, can you imagine, can you just imagine bad shit in your home and you run to control and tell her on her fucking life. All the owls and owlets 
como esta? Um, like, seriously. Why the fuck would you tell that psychotic broad in the head? Oh, when my dad touches me and my sister, that's that Sammy. I remember her. You don't tell Melissa exactly. You don't, you don't do that. Yeah. Exactly, Candy King. I listen. You don't tell Carissa nothing. Now she comes in here. Oh, because controller lended her an ear. Is that why? Oh, because she gave me an ear. You shouldn't air that shit out, Sammy, because now you get fucked with. Yes, she said it. Yes. And she, did you see what she said? Oh, that's not me. That's a different Sammy. No, it ain't. Here, guys, look. Look. No, it's not. That's you, Sammy, you lying sack of shit. You know why I know, guys? Because I know from her thumbnail. Fucking going in there. She goes in Alexandria, that pig's chat, and controller. So guys, I'm talking about this piece of shit um, for a minute. Let me get that up. Okay. Of course, Sammy is a douche. What's up, Nervy? Of course, she's a douche. Why would you run a control about anything? But guys, like, subscribe, and share. Let's get this fucker to a thousand. Um because she doesn't think. See, Amber says, it's funny because it's true. Oh, we're spicy, motherfuckers. Can like tuna. Healing her, how are you? Oh, uh, Sue was just on. She's actually talking to my ma. So, guys. I just brought my mom some groceries, put them outside at her house. She was she was out, I think, with the neighbor. But I do what I spoke. I'm I supposed to, I do what I'm supposed to with my mother. But guys, I wanted you guys to see Sammy, because now she's saying it wasn't her; it was a different Sammy. When this piece of shit knows, knows, she was crying to control her. Telling her about the incest at her house. Oh, you got it. I mean, what the fuck? You don't fucking do that shit. But guys, I'm Sue's gonna come back on and talk. And then I'm gonna have Barb. Yeah, they leave, Melissa, because when you catch them, especially something disgusting, now you guys. Every time you see that pink and you see Sammy, now you know who she is. Now you know what's going on. Fucking incest at her house, right? Fuck you telling Carissa for. And what are you telling Alexandria for? Oh, yeah. Them two psychotic fucking pieces of shit. Yeah, they can really help you. Sick fucking bastards. Let's do this, guys. I know, healing her. It's disgusting. And guys, I don't even like saying it. But I saw it. And then there's Sammy coming in here trying to break my fucking balls. Guess what, bitch? I saw you. You're a disgrace. Oh, I know, Amber. It's disgusting. But guys, I'm going to say this to you. Oh, flowers. Yeah, I know. INX, yeah, I'm begging. I'm not begging. Guys, let's do this. There's the cash app. Very hot already donated. Thank you. I don't have my phone. There's the cash app. They hate when you donate because Sammy needs money to get away from her ancestral family because the incest is real in her family. Right, Sammy? Oh, come on, guys. Like and subscribe. Did she say thank you? 
Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I said it was nice and cold. She was happy. And then Dominic called. I talked to him first. That's why. Oh, my God. Well, guys, I want you to know that um, we got a $50 donation. Very hot. Thank you. Duck, Sammy, if you check, she's up there in the pink. Sammy, you're still in here again? I, I outed her ass because Sammy was the one that was live with Controla telling her that there's incest in her family and she's got to break free and she don't know how because controller has been through it. Then she was on Alexandria's chat telling her about it. Now Sammy's in here. What's the matter, Sammy? You can't handle the truth? I put the fucking link in there five fucking times. You didn't hit it once because you're a sad, sorry piece of shit. Oh. Oh, flowers. First of all, they don't go anywhere out of the country, so you don't have to worry about any of them. Controller would be busted if she went anywhere because of drugs. We've been all over. She don't do nothing. But guys, since I'm begging, as they call it, Cash App. What the Cash App money is for is to go to Jersey and have all the people dinner and drinks or lunch and drinks, probably lunch and drinks, whatever. That. So, hypothetically, let's say we get, hey, oh, two, three hundred dollars. We're paying for everything else. All of it. So the cash app is just because you guys want us to go there. Now, one more thing before Sue talks. This. <laughs> You see them lines? You see this? That's transfer paper for a t-shirt. You guys are going to see. Hey, Chris, why don't you go fuck your mother? Really? Kind of disgusting. Oh, you can't talk about anybody, Alex, or controller like Chris. Why don't you bring your fucking ass on here and talk some shit? Come on. Come on, Chris. Come on. There's the fucking link, Chris. Want to act like a hard ass? You want to act like a hard ass, Chris? You think anybody gives a fuck? No, because I bet you your pussy ass won't come on here, will you? No, you won't, because you're a fucking coward pussy, too. Wow. You guys... Ran the Sue's family. Guess what, Chris? Because of motherfuckers like you, we're going to fuck with control his family. We're going to fuck with Alexandria's family. And when one of them motherfuckers gets fired, it's because of people like you. Here, pop on, Chris. You need some attention. Come on. Come on on here. Talk some shit, Chris, because that's what you won't do. You fucking pussies. You guys are cowards. Sammy's a coward. Chris. Sakosha, come on. Really, Chris? Well, why don't you come on and tell us the story? Oh, is that Chris wants to talk about my family? Come on. Come on. Pop on here. Let's, yeah. Let's hear what you got to say. Mm -hmm. Since you claim you know so much. Mm -hmm. Come on. I'll bet you what Sue's family did tell you was we paid the house off, right? Come on. You're so badass. You're a pussy. Just like all the rest. You're a fucking coward. Wow. Always itchy. I know all. Uh, that's controller. Hmm. Healing ain't. Come on. They're not talking about Sue. They they have no clue what they're talking about. No. You don't but have guys, listen. Family. Good luck with that one. But before Sue gets going, mm. they hate when you donate. But we don't keep the money. Hey, Chris, guess what? All the messages have been sent to me. <laughs> I have all the messages. When people tell you stuff, they're playing you for a fool. They're playing you, they're Chris. Playing you dumb fuck. 
Cheryl sent her all the messages. They you just asked me. us, like I said the other day, not to share it. She said, don't but share they're, it. They're messing with you back, telling you what you want to hear, because they think it's actually funny how stupid you people are. Because <laughs> you get played. You get played. They get info out of you, dumb fuck. If you knew anything, you know I have a lot of family. Yeah. And you don't even know. Go me. ahead, Susan. Okay. That's okay. Susan. But that's okay. So the more you keep bringing up certain people's names, the more I'm going to start talking to Controller's family because I haven't talked to Healing Earth said, I swear Sue doesn't age. Hey, oh, you guys, let me tell you something. I'm going to let Sue talk. She's 50 and proud. I'm very proud to be 50. My nose is itching again. Yeah. She's 50 and proud. And here, guys, it's this is mine. so stupid. Look. It's all mine. Look. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, honey. Fucking hi, Ginger. People say I fucking she's got a wig. You guys wish. Oh my. You guys wish you looked as good as Sue does. I'm 44 with AIDS. Bitch, I now we I'm sorry. Now we know why you got booted. Why'd you get booted? Because you have AIDS and you wouldn't take a test. You wouldn't take it. It's test. already there. We got all the papers. Oh, Ginger, you. good for you. you. You wouldn't take a test, and so they threw it out. Plus, they said you smelled and you have stuff coming out of your vagina. That's disgusting, bitch. Go clean yourself. And you called me an old lady? Bitch, I'm only a few years older than you. Guys, find out if that Alexandria Melanie Myers, if that's real or not. Because I hope it is real. Because, here, I'm going to tell that piece of shit. White supremacy? Bitch, I'm Jewish. How would I be part of white supremacy, you fucking idiot? So Alexandra, but isn't that funny? A black Alexandra, chick. you're a black the racist chick. one. We're not racist. You're the racist one. You don't like white well, come women. On. Come on, if that's you, could uh, come on on. Come on, Alexandra. Hit that fucking come stream. On, Alexandra. Let's I'll rip go, your bitch. ass a new asshole. And I'll rip your ass you apart. Won't come on. Come on, Alexandra. A coward. Alex! No, Alex, you're racist because you hate white people. But that's all right, Alex. Because when we get to somebody you love. <laughs> when they lose, I, you guys click on it. This see if it's the real dumb fuck. Somebody said Alex is 100% absolutely a racist. She is a racist. Of course she's a pig racist. She fucking hates white people. She hates white women like me because. Because uh, you won't, Alexander, because you you'll won't. get fucking dead. You won't. Because we'll put your ass mm -hmm. in chat, sorry. Alex, you don't fucking like coward. women like me. Because we always took the man that you wanted. Because the white guy that's a good guy don't want your ass. That's why you don't like white people. You're the biggest racist. You're the only one who brings up racist, you. And this has been going on for years. We have papers of years that dates back to, what, 14, 13? Hey, Alex, why are we trying to fuck your nephew? I'm still trying to figure that yeah, out. Yeah, what the fuck, you guys? What's going on with Alexandria getting drunk, hitting on her nephew? Go you ahead and say... Nasty bitch. We go ahead and it, say huh? you didn't do it, Alex. Because I fucking got it. Go ahead and say you didn't. Fucking disease infected. Racist. Fucking piece You're of shit. You're a racist. You are a racist, Alex. You are. You guys are gonna racist. tell me that's a fucking normal person. She's cuckoo. Look, Look at, at this piece Look of at shit. Eyes. Look at them fucking eyes. Racist. What's the matter, Sammy? How could you just said you were gonna come on here? You're going to get one more chance. Not true. Alexandra is a racist. Alexandra, Alexandra is a racist. You are the biggest racist, racist pig. In the world. But let me tell you what you did do. Since your ass is black, you were stalking us and my son. Yeah. The charges. Yeah. Oh, see, Sammy, that's all you got. Oh, is that all you got is worth? Uh, whacked? Oh, okay. 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 Just in the Bible. Oh my God, I know she knows nothing about Sue. Nothing about me. Come on, Sammy. Come on, on. Nothing. I'll about tell me. you what. Why don't Alexandria and Sammy? Why don't you both come on at the come same on. time? I know why you hate me. 
because you can't have me. And I know why you hate her. Because she's so pretty, she took guys that you wanted in school. Mm -hmm. The red hair, the mm -hmm. blue eyes. I remind you of that, Alex. Remember that girl that stole the guy that you wanted, the white guy? You didn't want your stinky pussy. That's right, Sammy. Stinky pussy. That's all you got. Alex. Sammy, listen. You need to go back to Controller and ask her why she told everybody that your dad was fucking you. Oh, wait, wait. I'm trying to take Controller's kid. I don't want Controller's child. <laughs> yeah. I'm good. We, yeah. have, we have wonderful Listen, kids. Listen, I'm going to say it. Child. I'm going to say it straight up. Nobody wants that piece of shit. Wait, wait, wait. Kid. What is she saying? Are being. Who cares? Who cares? Who gives a fuck, Alexander? Nobody wants Controller's child. We just want our child. Who to gives be a safe. fuck? Fuck her, kid. Fuck her whole family. But why is that you Alex guys so started. I'm sorry. You guys started a war that you're not gonna fucking win. Hey Alex, where are your children at? Where are your kids at, Alex? Where's Do you know husband? why you don't have kids, Alex? Where's Alexander? your boyfriend at, Alex? Where, where's your family at? Your family fucking hates you. Your family hates you, Alex. Really, Chris? Hmm. Mm. Come on with it, motherfucker. You're in the family? Okay. No, it's in the no. He says he's in the family. He did not say yeah, that. He goes, no, he didn't. He's he, in the family. I'm in the no. I am you in the no. You are not welcome to... Oh, really? Chris said. Oh, you cry like a bitch. Mm. Alexandra, you don't have kids because nobody would lay. Keep talking about other families and how exposure. Guess what, Chris? Say what the fuck you want. Because when I catch your ass... Your ass is fucked too, motherfucker. Mm -hmm. We got you, motherfucker. Don't even worry about it. I'm going to fix your fucking ass. You can keep talking. You're a pussy coward. Wow. You know how to make phone calls, Chris. Oh, you're a badass. Oh, you're a pussy. That's why you keep coming in here. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Alex had two abortions. Wow, Alexandria. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. If you do the Lord's work, like you claim, and you read the Bible, you're not supposed to have why abortions. you having abortions? You're not supposed to have an abortion. Yeah, motherfuckers don't want to have kids with you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, but you are a pig. Hey, do you guys know? Um, you smell a black box candy. Click on that and see if that's Alexandria. No, that's not Christian, Michelle. Um, you guys hit Alexandria's thing. Alex, Alex is an abortion. Yeah. I talk. You're going to see. You're going to see my actions, bitch. Mm -hmm. You're going to fucking see. Yeah. Only mods can check. I can't. How I check. Just click on it. All I do is talk. You guys, is that her? Because I'm going to fix her fucking damn, ass. Ugly. You God so damn. Ugly. What, and what was the story about um, oh my God, Bort, yeah. That would be awesome, wouldn't it? <laughs> uh, oh, look at, look at how you guys cry. You, you know what's so funny? Um, the only way they're going to find out if that's real, Alex, if we can get her to do a blood test. She won't do a blood test. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. William, you just want to hit the it's nail hot. on the head. Yeah, it's hot in here. Yeah, it's hot in here. I'm sorry. It's so fucking funny. All you guys do is talk. You know why? Because you pussy cowards can't do nothing. Nothing. Because if you could, you'd do something. That's all. And you can't do shit. Because if you fucking saw me, we'll see. That Freddy Krueger sweater is from Jackie Earl Haley from the movie. Alex is very homophobic. 
But that's all right, you guys. They can't do shit. They can't do anything. Nothing. Nothing. None of you motherfuckers can do anything. Because if you had balls, you'll meet me at fucking um, in Jersey. Not one of you motherfucking. Yeah. Yeah. Trisha Evans. Hmm. Is that all you got? Is rhetoric garbage little kid talk? What are we? What are we fucking in high school? Huh? Like seriously. What are we going to do? Nothing. Nothing. Not going to do nothing. Sorry. Yeah. Not going to do shit. Yep. Not going to do a fucking thing. Because if you did, you'd fucking do something. But you can't. Yeah, it could be, Rocky. It could be. But that's all right. Is she mentally challenged? Yep. She is mentally challenged. That's right. So do what you got to do, guys. Here's the deal, though. We're going to be there, New Jersey. That's it. Going to be down there. If any of you motherfuckers want to step up, that's going to be your chance. So, oh, she's a homophobic racist in the worst fucking way. And, and what's funny is, what's really funny, sure you will. Guess what, Alexandria? You ain't doing nothing. You're not doing shit. Mrs. You got age, you're going to spit on people. Bitch, you'd never get the chance to get fucking close enough to my ass to spit on me. That's a fucking fact. Now, if you want to bring your ass, okay? Great, Alexandria. Nobody cares about your stupid fucking uh, bullshit fucking web pages. Nobody gives a fuck, bitch, because everybody knows you're a racist pig. You hate white people. There's already people that have talked to your family. They fucking disowned your disease-infected ass. And that's it. You guys talk like little kids. Do you know why? I'm not 55, you fucking duck. Oh, there's little bear cub. Why don't you go fuck your dad? Because I saw you crying to Carissa about how family members touch your ass too. Oh, oh. Meet me behind the library? No, motherfucker. You can meet me right in front of it. Yeah. Bunch of little cowards. All they do is talk. Oh, oh. Dog, oh. Yeah. Alex, dad, Ivan is watching. I text him the link. Oh, that's great. Well, come on, you guys. Check that out. It's almost like, that's right. Yeah, exactly, healing. Nobody give a fuck. Uh, I saw Kelly. This is not about Amber. Yeah. I who's, Nobody said it was about Amber. But anyways, guys. I'm going to be there. Did you read the other She's going to be there. Huh? Did you read the text? No. What text? No. Oh. Yeah. Okay. It's time. Now, guys, let's be honest. Alexander, you can push me all you want, motherfucker, because you push me enough. You're going to see my fucking ass. You're going to tell me that that ain't a crazy bitch, that right? That picture, you guys, that picture is going to be on T-shirts, and we are going to sell them out in Jersey. And it's going to have control on it. And guess what? There ain't a goddamn thing any one of you motherfuckers are going to do except sit and take it. 
You want to make stupid fucking, uh, which cults about me? Yeah, she looks like the exorcist. If you think you look good, you're full of shit. Look at, people are already pre-ordering them. Oh, trust me. That cockeyed, yeah, oh, that cockeyed fucking pig, racist as fuck, talk, bitch. You'd never fuck fucking person. Fuck that. None of fuckers, not one of you motherfuckers would fucking ever meet me. I'm going to be in Jersey. You can fucking come and see me any motherfucking time. Any fucking time. Any of you motherfuckers want to step up to me, fuck it. I'm going to show how short. Uh-huh. That's right. A little over. And guys, there's old Tom 504. And guys, let me tell you two things, three things that you need to know about March 20th, okay? Number one, the judge is a very mean judge. She's a grandma. Hey, Jersey girl, how are you? They don't play, number one, with child neglect. Number two, the prosecutor's a woman. She don't play. Number three, the lead detective is a woman. Strike three, bitch. They're all women. They got kids. They got great kids. Chris is a piece of shit. Fuck her. Fuck her whole family. Fuck you, Alexandra. And fuck your whole family. She's going to court, nervy. Fault Rainey, hey, happy weekend, how are you? So Control is actually going to court for six charges. Reckless driving, reckless driving causing injury, and child neglect number two. Guys, I'm going to say it again. I'm going to let Sue talk for a little bit, and we're going to let Barb talk. I'm going to say this. She gets tried. She gets convicted of child neglect too. She's going to prison. Alexandra, fuck your lawyer. You got my number. Have your piece of shit lawyer call me. And trust me, don't worry about your family, bitch. People get done with them, they'll be in the bread line. Benny Brett, what's happening now? Well, Alexandria is making threats to me, Sue, and my kid. And Controller thinks it's funny. When we start fucking pushing with family, people get mm -hmm. fired. People mm -hmm. lose homes. People lose jobs. You're going to see, bitch. Mm -hmm. Come on, guys. Get them likes up. RR said, hey, come on, sit. Oh. Here, Rocky. Now you can see her since the haters hate Sue. You guys, let's be honest. Let's just stop for a minute. She is prettier than all them nasty broads put together. Alexandria's upset because the guy in school she wanted liked the redhead. Mm -hmm. You hated Alex? Yeah, he, like, she's going to hire a, a fucking black guy. Yeah. Um, who's ugly as pigs? Yeah, they are. They sure the fuck are. Hot as fuck. You're right. Controla and fucking Alexandria, they sure are. Rick, remember Fatty saying she wouldn't commit a crime with her child, but she's got six charges. Oh, I listen. Oh, I know. I fucking know. And you know what, Ronnie? She is fucked. Like, like she's fucked. Well, I'm going to tell you right now, Controller, because you were reaching out to family. Oh, yeah, what? healing. Oh, yeah. Because well, you're she, from Michigan, awesome. Because you will not stop reaching out to family members. That's all she wrote, Controller. You're making all this worse she wrote. for you. And I'm going to tell you guys this. Indirectly, it all ties to her. Okay, and I told you, Jacinda, I told d -Lynn, I told all you motherfuckers, one of you guys fuck with me, I'm fucking with all of you. Mm -hmm. 
When I get somebody you love and they lose jobs and homes. Well, this is what the toilet you. does to other people. This is what you guys this do. This is what you do. My turn. You yeah. can keep making all them stupid fucking websites that five people go to. Good for you, You bitch. can't even sing, Alex. Why do you sing? You sound like a Oh, my fucking, God. Oh, my God. Stanton Island. Oh, yeah. They called control a Drano. Why the fuck would she admit that? Like, seriously, why would you fucking admit that shit? Yeah, clean it. You mean cleaning them pipes, Purple Buzz. Hmm. Go ahead. So, yeah, Alex. Um, this you guys is, are fucked. Yeah, yeah. I mean, what is? it's just disgusting already. So, people want to know yes, healing. why we're going to this court date. Because she will not stop. She will not stop, and I've had it. I have honestly fucking had it. And not one damn thing's going to happen. I'm going to tell you that much right now. Um, oh, oh black guy. Really? Chris Sack, go fuck yourself. Seriously. Chris Sack, you know what? You, you run around everybody's fucking chat. Remember you used to talk shit in Courtney's chat? Mm -hmm. You're a weak ass. You hide because you're a pussy. Mm -hmm. And you know what? Fucking Chris Sack, I'll see your ass in Jersey, but guess what? You won't be there. Do you know why none of you people will no. be there? And I'll tell you what, Chris, because if you walked up to me and got like that, I'll finish it. Your head will go through the wall. I've seen him do But that. you won't because you guys think you're tough hiding behind a computer. Me, I go real life. He does. I'm going to be there because we already talked to administration and everybody. You're mm -hmm. doing nothing. Mm -hmm. This is what. Of course, Jersey. Mm -hmm. I... Is this drag queen story hour? I don't know, Lewis. Is it? You ugly fuck. Is it? You guys think that shit bothers us. But the more you press, the more I'm going to press. Mm -hmm. The more you guys come in here and fuck with me, I'm fucking with controller. I'm fucking with them. And I'm going to get to somebody that they actually care about. Mm -hmm. And when they lose jobs in homes, it's on you. Yeah. And I've told you, motherfucker, because I'm not saying shit now. You don't know who's working in the back. You don't know who's working the system. No. You don't know who's finding out shit. You know nothing. You just assume. Honey, these people are trash. I've been fighting them for two years. Are you serious? You've been fighting them for two years? <laughs> You're, but, oh my God, are you serious? You've been fighting these people. Oh, shit. Literally, you're pathetic. You've been so old. Their photos in the back are black and white. <laughs> you just got to come up. You have no shit. You want to come up and talk? Or you you stay uh unreal. Isn't that funny though? It's bad they found my Instagram. Oh, I'm sorry. You know what's funny though? You can't fuck with me. No. This is what you don't understand. No. You can't fuck with me. They were talking shit about my cousin and all that. And it's not me. You can't fuck with and me. You can't fuck with me neither. Because if you could do something, you, you fucking can't. pussy cowards would have already did it. But you can't. They make up You lies. can't do shit. They make up so much shit. What That's you, the truth. And what's my government name, Alex? Oh, didn't you say that shit too? Hmm. Oh, wow, pathetic. Well, you know what? Let me, let me do this. Yeah. The little girl's going to get a voice healing and don't even worry about it. Yeah, that Freddy Krueger jersey, that's uh, Jackie Early Haley's from the movie. Let me tell you this, you're pathetic. Reach out to me. Mm -hmm. Okay? Reach out to me on Instagram. And, and let's talk. One thing is and we'll help you, you're pathetic. We will help you. One thing... These people are not our scenes. We don't back down. Thank you. We are not backing down. 
You can make up lies about our families. You yep. can reach out to everybody you want. We're not scared. We're not mad. We know the truth. You know, when you're lying, and I'll tell you this much, control it. You've been doing this to years for people. Thank you. you go after their families. You reach out to the families. Everything you accuse others of doing, you do yourself. And you do the same shit, Alex. Yep. So, Alex, I'm going to tell you, I'm not scared of your fucking ass, you piece of shit, you racist bitch. You're not doing nothing. You're a racist bitch, Alex. Isn't it pretty? You guys see how jealous, and then you get jealous, normal Alex? people that are, you know, it takes a lot of money and time to. Unreal. Right. Let's be honest, you guys. Unreal. Unreal. Let's unreal. be honest. Alex, you jealous? You racist bitch? Let's be honest. Racist. Let's you? just be honest now. That racist pig is that nappy is as fuck. There's there's pictures of her, and you, you guys. It's an ugly woman. Let's call it. My Instagram is Rick Bastuba. Let's call this like it is. Miss mm -hmm. Parker, who we're trying to get on here, she's kind of left this stuff alone. She got Alex called her out because she wouldn't take an AIDS test. She got booted and shit can from sucking dick. How the fuck you get fired from sucking dick? Because your pussy smells. The neck always wins. Hey, Alex, why don't you go clean your pussy? That's why you don't have So your on. pathetic said she's half black and she hates her. You see what I'm saying? Jesus Christ. She don't even like her own people. That's really pathetic. But Miss Parker had her blood test. You guys, I had blood test, and I took a. a she called her her kid. That, oh my god. Sure, she did. Alex, you're sick. You know why? Because she don't care. But you guys, anyways, I do blood work. Um, I have a, I'm allergic to certain food. I don't know what it is yet. I did full blood test, hundred percent healthy. Alex, I'll pay you <coughs> to HIV see your test. blood work. <laughs> Let's see your blood work, Alex. And all the years I was fighting, I had to take blood tests all the time. Never had nothing. Yeah, knock on wood. Your pathetic wood. thank you. You guys, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. That's the cash app for when we go to Jersey. And guys, again, they hate when you guys use the cash app mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. they don't like it. Barry Hot just donated. Thank you. That is to help everybody when you're down there for dinner, drinks, and all that. Now, when people want to know, like you said, we're going why we're going there, when you've gone overboard and you go yes, after Rocky. our loved ones and you don't stop. I'm not stopping. And honestly, I am worried about her daughter. I, I I just, I'm worried about that little girl's safety. I really am with that. You're not a mother, Controller, And that's just the way it is. Check your vitamin levels. It's very important to request. Um, yeah, I was a tad low on iron. Like a lot of people. What did Rainy say? Look at that. Yeah. Fire crash. Well, guess what, dummies? If I'm a natural redhead. The carpet matches the drapes. You idiots. That's like so high school. Oh, pathetic. That's okay. Don't That's worry about it. That's what a high school person. Or what did Ronnie say? I want to read what Ronnie said. Where, where, Where's Ronnie? Ronnie, where's your comment at? Mm, I didn't see it. Um, that, That's all right. But guys, complete levels of everything. Yeah. Yeah, he, her, he, you guys, you got hacked, by the way. Oh, shit. But, guys, anyways, yeah, they can true. keep saying what they want about Sue. You see how angry it makes her? I'm it doesn't. I'm now, don't care. Hey, Lady Bathory, what's up? Now, read what Duck said. Controller was calling churches. Oh, but that's okay. To call church in the house of God, and that's okay. so because of that. <clears throat> absolutely, Lisa. And Lisa, you know the truth. You know what Miss Parker said. That shut Alexandra up, and I'll pay mm -hmm. her to see her uh her blood because she's a fucking liar. Mm -hmm. But since you like to call churches, you like to me, 
We're going to fuck with you guys. Mm -hmm. I think I hear a dog here. Uh oh. And D Lynn, you stupid bitch. <laughs> I can't wait to expose your. Oh, ass. D Lynn, we're saving you for last. Come here, Bubba. Hi, Bubba. Come here. Come here. Up. Come here. Go you gotta go potty. I'll go outside. She okay. likes to sit in between the door Come on. and the bar room. Actually, it's called a parlor because the house is so old. And Denali likes to sit. She'll sit right there on the floor in between the office and the parlor. <clears throat> but you guys, let's call it like it is. We're all fucking adults. Let's call it like it is. Not one. I, you, what's popping? I actually, when I did talk to Miss Parker, it wasn't about this. Ella's going to reach out to Miss Parker for me. Yeah. She's going to reach out. Um, so I actually haven't, but I know the truth, you guys. And let's be honest. There is so much damaging evidence about um, <clears throat> Alexandria. Well, they actually call it, you know, back in the day, because the house is so old, it was the parlor room. But for us, it's the bar room. We have arcade games. I got memorabilia all over the wall. I got a carved Indian cigar statue. I got a Picasso vase. So it's it's a bar room. But back then they called it the parlor. So as I was saying, okay, uh, Benny, you know what? I'll bet you, I'll bet you Miss Parker would because of Ella, because me and Ella are real tight now. Now, what I was going to say is, we're all adults. So let's just call it like it is. I'm a loud adult, but I back what I say. Any you motherfuckers step up to me, anyone in Jersey, that'll be it. I'll fucking take it from there. Now, say what you want. Do what you think you need to do. Okay, But I'm going to tell you this. Not one of you fuckers got balls. When I sell t-shirts, you ain't doing shit. I'm going to wear a fucking t-shirt. I'll have Sue. She'll cut it because her boobs are so big. Yeah, control his head. Alexander's face. Control his fucked up face. What are you going to do about it when I sell T-shirts? Nothing. Oh, Rocky, I'll have Ella on when Ella wants to come on. Absolutely. But let's have let's get Barb on because Barb has something to say. Oh, awesome. Did she? Wow. Hey, JC, how are you? Oh, I know. I. That was Susan. Did you have anything else to say? Okay, because I'm gonna have Barb come on to talk about oh. the witch stuff. I'm just gonna make this very clear because I'm like you fools, Alex. I actually have a family to take care of. Yeah, Lisa. Um, Ella said she would, but I, you, you know, if Ella don't want to, you know, I we I'm, love Ella. So yeah, but I'm gonna tell you right now. Keep running your fucking mouth. Keep making up stories. I don't give a shit at this moment. Rick, clap Miss Parker's cheeks. Do you do you guys think you know like that shit's That's funny? So stupid. That's dumb. Anyways, we will be there tomorrow morning. A week or a week from tomorrow morning. <laughs> tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning. A week from tomorrow Stop morning. Our... Justice for Ellie. Hey. Justice for everybody else that's been affected by Controlla begins in eight days. Thank you. Look how fat Sue is. Size 312 pounds. And Alex. Oh, what I think, Alex? Wow, she's so Alex, fucking Alex, shut fat. your fucking mouth, bitch. Stop talking about my government name, bitch. I know what my name is. You're talking about my ex-brother-in-law who's a piece of shit. I don't care. Yeah, hold on a minute, Barb. Go ahead. Shut your fucking mouth, Alex. I'm telling you right now, bitch, 
You think you intimidated all the women? Bitch, you just met your match. I'm your worst fucking nightmare in a 5-2 frame. Fuck you. Okay. Wow. Oh. And be ready tomorrow or a week from tomorrow. When I see you control it, my hair will be all gorgeous. What what is the word she looks she uses with her hair? What was the word control? Luxurious. Oh, my hair will be luxurious. She got that from Cat Williams. Mm. Oh, honey, your hair is luxurious oh. now. Oh, Jersey oh, where? Middlesex County court date. Control is so much better. That's why. Because Control lives a better life than all of us, and she's got everything, and we have nothing, and we're jealous. And according to Alex, we'll have no money. We don't make any more money off you two. Oh. oh, my God, you guys. Oh. Alex said that if we don't get donations, we're going to kill ourselves. Is this going to be the end? <laughs> Go on. No, Alex, go to the doctor, get the fucking shit taken out of your vagina and get some medicine because you fucking smell from over here. I can smell you all the miles away. You're nasty. Stop talking shit about us. That's funny what Sue's only fans. Sue has more respect for herself than that. I had an only Yeah. Well, if I get paid to show my my hands, maybe. Or feet, they like all that stuff. Yeah. Hey. But that's okay. You guys can be keep making the fake accounts. Keep saying the garbage you want about us. It oh, does you're not in Jersey. Yeah, Middlesex County. It's fucking, Superior Court. It's funny. We will be a court. That's just the way it is because this has gone too far into our personal lives. And, and we're done with it. And I'm not playing. And Alex, keep running your fucking <coughs> mouth. You can't sing. You're a lonely old hag. You fucking have HIV. You're nasty. You smell. You have no life. You have no man. You have nothing. You are so jealous of women like me and anybody else. And really, bitch, I don't fucking blame you. you but keep running your mouth about me. Keep talking. Keep talking. Keep running it, You bitch. know, you know, Alexandria. Alexandria. You know you're only uh, six years older than or younger than Sue. That's a Sue hasn't been rode through mud been fucked by 400 people You're and nasty. looked like a scumbag piece of shit nasty. nasty you don't get it you are nasty you're disgusting you are nasty. and just so you guys are clear alexandria didn't diss her family her family disowned her because look at now her. that that is true and i want to bring something up now, I know that, that people have been asking me about um, the wiki page that Alexandra made on me. Now, listen, you guys, I'm in great company on that wiki page, and I would have been very upset if she hadn't put me up there. But let me tell you something, and you guys are going to, you guys, I want you to pay attention to this, because every time you hate watch Alexandra, because we all do it, we don't laugh with her, we laugh at her. Every time you hate watch her, I want you guys to realize that everything that she says about me, Sue, other women, Controller herself, because let's not forget, she hated Controller. I've got a story about that, but every time she does that, it's the jealousy, it's the venom in here. Now, I it's been brought to my attention that Wiccanism and witchcraft has been getting dragged through you know, through the internet here. And Alexandra, you must be fucking new because if you think that you're going to be talking about Wicca or witchcraft when I'm around and acting like you know anything about it, let me let me tell you a little story, Alexandra. Do you remember when you hated Controla and Controla hated you and Controla was saying, because you were giving her such a bad time. She said, you know what? I need Barb. Somebody get Barb because I need Barb to send me some, some candles. You know why she said that? Everybody else here does, Alexandra. Why didn't you know? You know, um, and you and it made an impression on you because you went and you made a video about Controla talking about She's doing witchcraft. Alexandra, your dramatics are <laughs> hilarious. And I never want you to stop. I want you to continue to talk just like this forever. You are a mental patient five times over. 
that's quite an accomplishment. But I did want to, so anyway, with, with the, um, with the, okay, now look, Rick and Sue both know that I tried to defend Controlla as long as I could because she hasn't done anything to me. She, and, and she still really hasn't, except that she's a bit of an asshole. But one of the things that I've always told Controlla is that I would be very happy to help her with her tarot card readings because she's got a good collection of tarot cards. I myself have been teaching tarot um, for what, 10 mm. years, and I've been doing tarot since I was 15. The problem with Controlla's tarot, and I've discussed this with her, is that she doesn't do reversals. And if you don't do reversals, you miss half of the meaning. So Alexandra, when you talk about magic with a K, be careful with that, girlfriend, in all seriousness. Be careful with that. But when you talk about magic with a K and her talent for tarot reading, it tells me once again that you literally have no idea what you're talking about. And if there's anything worse than I hate than a smelly bitch or a liar, it's ignorance. And you are all three, girl. You're all three. <clears throat> So what I've decided to do is, um, okay, I, I have a Lifestyles uh, YouTube channel that I really haven't done much on, but I'm thinking about this, and I want you guys in chat to help me out with this. Um, would you be interested in a, not a YouTube channel, but for me to create, because um, I don't care about making money on any of this, but for me to create a Instagram that is specifically teaching spells and teaching tarot for free. If you're interested in that, pop me a DM um, and it's B-L-A-C-K-K-A-T-0-0-3. Um, and uh, that's my IG. And, and let me know if you'd be interested. In the meantime, Alexandra, if you have anything further to add to Wicca or witchcraft, <clears throat> Come talk to me. I dare you. I dare you. And Controlla, even your mods are telling you to get rid of that dingbat bitch. You're just letting her go on. You know, I tried with Rick and Sue. I really tried to talk to them for you. But girl, you, you, you basically gave me a huge fuck you. I could have helped you. I could have helped you. She don't want help, Barb. She, she never took she... me up on the tarot card thing. No. Look, true, true people of the craft really don't ask for money. I'm very happy to teach people what I know. And speaking of what I know, is anybody interested in, um, that's right, Nervy, is anybody interested in learning a quick little spell right now for, um, for haters? If you're no. interested, drop a Just one in the chat, and I'm very happy to teach you guys a little, a little thing. Do now, do it. first of all, I've already been working with some crystals and some incense while this live has been going on, okay? So if you are truly here for Rick and, um, and the above knows what's in your heart, you've already been protected. So nobody's going to come at you. And if they do come to me, I'll help you out. In the meantime, if you would like to get pissy people like Alexandra off your back, I want you guys to grab a jar specific. and I want you guys to take some nails, some broken glass and anything that smells bad, maybe a piece of shit. That would be, and I'm not kidding when I say that, that really signifies Alexandra that shows who the jar is for. Then you can put some vinegar in it. But if you really want to pop it up, you pee into the into the jar. 
screw it back on, take a candle and light it, drip some wax around the candle and then bury it someplace. And you only need to bury it about six inches. And uh, Alexandra, I really wouldn't wanna be you. You've got so many people mad at you. Someone's gonna drop a house on you. Run <sighs> down by the river. Yeah. I'm serious as a heart attack. I know she's I missed what you just said, Brett. Mad because somebody dropped. Oh, I know. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Um so Barb, how how long is your your family? How many generations does your family go back to the East Coast? Oh Jesus! Well, it all started in Vermont, so I don't know. Uh, probably six generations, five or six generations. Really? Mm hmm. So, guys, wh what Barb is trying to say. Okay, and she's not trying to say anything else, so don't look into it, that basically, and Lisa has said this too, Wiccans, their motto, and Lisa actually corrected me, but it's basically, thou shall harm no one, something to that effect. Right, do harm to no one. See, here's the difference between Wicca and witchcraft. Right. Wicca is Wicca is um has some rules. You know, if anybody really wants to learn a lot about, you know, witchcraft 101, get Raymond Buckland's book. It's called The Book of Witchcraft. It's like a freaking phone book. It's like a, a deadly weapon. But it, it's really good. It's user friendly. Um, and that's the first book that I would recommend to anybody who's interested in the craft that way. But with witchcraft, witchcraft can be done either in a coven of 13 or it can be done as a solitary. I personally do both. Um, but right. there are no rules. Okay. And if anybody asks, mm -hmm. are you a good, you know, a black witch or a white witch? There is no such thing. There's no such thing. I agree. Yeah, see, there's Lisa. She said it. <clears throat> so basically, you guys, what Barb and Lisa in the chat <clears throat> and other Wiccans in that are saying is, control is not a Wiccan because she's trying to do no, evil. No, control. Yeah. Controller is is not a Wiccan, and no. controller is. And I'm and I I'm not trying to be mean when I say this. Controller would agree with me because we've talked about it. She's a half-assed tarot card reader because she only does upright. She doesn't do reverses. No. I know a lot of you don't know what that means, but she does. She knows what that means. Right. Amber, you know the thing is, is that there's and Amber, I would love to know what your um. <laughs> IG is get a hold of me on Instagram. I would love to talk to you about a few things, especially in regards to Alexandra. Um, the thing is, is that there really is, some people say that witchcraft is a gray area. I don't even consider it that. There are some people out there that practice witchcraft that are terrible people that put spells on people and absolutely destroy people's lives. I don't do that. I make sure that they get exactly what they deserve. And most of the people that I surround myself with love that because they're great people. What they deserve is everything. You know what's funny about this, Barb, when you when when you talk about this? Come here. Um Rusty, when, don't worry about it, hon. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Listen, there's one person, I'm not going to mention her name, but there's one person that was actually in this chat not yes. that long ago tonight that has a little bit of experience for me. I begged her to come up on live. Where is she? 
Who are you talking about? She believes in me. Alexandra is no witch. And there is such thing as a Christian witch. That's probably one of the things that Alexandra said that I do agree with her with. But Alexandra can read her Bible to rags. She's a lousy Christian and she's not a witch. Wow, she's got two strikes against her. And not you. What are you doing? And Alexandra, make a million videos on me. Please, the, these people here in chat, they're all going to be watching to see what you say about me. And they're also going to be watching to see just how much you, you hate us. You do. You hate us. Still is everything that you could never be. <coughs> Plus the fact you have a crush on her fiance. No, she was right. And everybody knows it. Even the people that don't like Rick and Sue know it. They know it. No, but they spell it differently. If Control is going off in Discord, Controller knows one thing about me. Controller is she knows going that off I don't lie. She now. knows I don't lie. Carissa. I have had the tarot conversation with you and I offered to help you and you never took me up on it. Yeah. You like sitting right there. Uh, so I don't <clears> lie. <throat> I don't have say, to lie. Yeah. Dogs attack me apparently, but no, I was just going to say, so Denali, she's right here. She likes to sit in between the office in the parlor, she likes to. Hi, boo boo, what you doing? She likes sitting there. She don't like being. Um. Anyway, isn't that the dog that's afraid of you, Rick? I. Oh my God, we, <laughs> I've had her. So, <laughs> so I, Kristen. So oh, here's what I think. I and X, listen. I and X, Crystal Ann, and everybody. I mean, it's almost unfair to bring up what? Crystal Ann. She's the mental patient. Did her Blaming King away? for her grandmother's death. Of course she is. Of did, course did, she is. Pass away. Uh, I heard that her grandmother died a couple of weeks ago, but of course Crystal made it all about her. And oh God, um, Chris, Crystal I, well, she belongs so in a rubber room. <clears throat> That's right, um, Kristen. Yeah. Times three. three. Exactly. So, exactly. So, Barb, I, what I wanted to say, Barb, and we've talked about this, the whole Wicca thing, which I think is funny when idiot over there said, I hate witches. Remember I told you the story when I was in Salem? Yeah. Oh, God. Lori Cabot. Lori Cabot is an abs. Do you know that she's 90 years old? She and she is and just I, as fabulous as as ever she's fat if I anybody ever go, wants to go to salem massachusetts please dm me i will tell you all of the great spots to visit but Lori cabot is one place that you need so, to go visit <clears throat> your daughter so has a shop you. there so i told you i went there mm -hmm. in <clears throat> about 2000 and 2004 2005 and I met mm -hmm. Lori. Now I've been there three or four other times. When I went with Sue, I saw Lori and she was staring at me. We were in her shop and she was staring at me. Mm -hmm. And she was looking. She said, I remember you. She remembered me. From oh, all she's sharp. Time. She is great. Oh, she's fantastic. So yeah. I didn't say anything, Barb, when um, when idiot said, "Now I'm racist or prejudiced against Wiccans," which is absolutely two hundred percent a fucking lie. Well, of course it is. You're friends with me. Well, I mean, that's that. the thing. Like I said, the ignorance. People talking out of their ass that they have no idea what they're talking about is ridiculous. Carissa, I'm going to tell you one more thing, all right? 
you need to get away from Alexandra. You really do. And I know what you're going to say, because you've already said it before. You're going to say, I didn't ask Alexandra to, to back me up. No, I don't believe that you did. I really don't. But she has made it so much worse for you. She really has. And the, and the, the, the sucky thing is, Carissa, is that you know that. You know what Alexandra is. She's a bad And you person. just let her... You let her wreck you. Yeah. Seriously. I tried to tell you. The last time that you and I talked on the phone, Carissa, I tried to tell you that. <laughs> and you told me, I know, I know. Now, look, I know that Alexandra doesn't give a shit whether you like her or not. She said that a million times. That's why she's so dangerous to you. Carissa. So let me, you let me need say, to get away from this woman. You need to get a restraining order care. on this woman. She has made it so much worse for you. It didn't have to be like but this. Even her friend, even her fr so-called friends said, Alex is making it worse. Jucinda, little miss, loudmouth fucking... Um, uh, Dragonflies told Controla, stop with Alex, it's not good. You know what Controla said? Fuck that, yeah, it is. So all this shit is because of them. And now I'm not going to fucking stop. And I am going to make T-shirts, and I am going to sell it with your fucking face on it. And I don't give a fuck. And I told you people, stop fucking with me. And I'm going to say it again. When family members and people you give a shit start losing jobs and stuff, you'll back the fuck up. Now, INX just said that uh, Alex's dad was watching her live and she fucking clicked off. Yeah, and that doesn't surprise uh, me. So a lot of people, people have sent me some A lot of people have been sending me things on Alexandra. It's like I have got so much. It's like I could write a book on what everything that you ever didn't want to know about Alexandra. I mean, it's it's she, I don't know what went wrong in her life, but she took a bad turn somewhere. Um, so unfortunately, the parent now the parents are no longer married. Um, but yeah. Alexandra has caused so much grief for her family. And they may not, okay, they may not have been, you know, leave it to beaver perfect, right? But How do we know? they were what she had. They were what she and her sister had. They were all, she should have made the best out of it. But instead... Oh, like I said, the worst thing that I think Alexandra has done is what she's what she said about her yeah. dad. I just I just hate that shit. I really hate that shit. But Alex, but trust and believe Alexandra's family is tortured by her. Tortured. I would be embarrassed. I mean, I let's really think about it. There is so much stuff. Barb, check this out. There is so much stuff on Alexandria and this bitch, uh, excuse me, at first laugh, like, oh, he's trying to get info. Look at this shit. There's this talking about um, she's going to end people. That means she's going to kill people. Um, there's her sister talking about jail and stuff. This all this is about her um, getting booted from stuff, getting thrown out of stuff. I mean, this is all about her stalking, harassing, and threatening people and kids and everything. But one thing she's not going to do, she's not going to fuck with me and my son. If she's got balls yeah. to fucking confront me or any of you sad, sorry fuckers that think control is special. All you got to do is come to Jersey, 
We're going to fucking be there. I'm going to be signing autographs for three days. Ha ha. Come with it. I'll handle the rest. So, Rusty, just so you know, um, she has been, since she was 17 years old, um, and I have this on good authority, she has been in a mental institution um, five times, and she was committed. She didn't just walk in the door and say, hi, I have problems. She was actually committed. Now, on one end of the, the, you know, you have to feel sorry for the mentally ill, right? But when they take it as far as like her, people like her and Crystal Lan and people like that, you know, some, some of the weirdos that you may run into on the internet, Sorry. Mental illness lo- no longer becomes an excuse. Right. Right. But I, yes, Tia, that's correct. Five times. Five times. But see, I want everybody to see that she is going to be so mad at me for telling her secrets. That she is going to go wild and add more stuff onto my wiki. I want you guys to look up uh, her wiki page so that you can keep track of everything that she says about me. I fucking love it. I love it. She can't find anything bad on me. You know, she'll call me old. Listen, Alexandra, I got a secret for you, baby cakes. I am 57 years old. And if you make it to 57 years old... And I'm as happy as I am and as happy with what I see in the mirror looking back at me. You've won. But girl, what are you, 44 years old and it's already too late for you. Your, oh, your, heart, your heart is black, which no, is not a racist remark, Alexandra. You make racist remarks about all of us who, you know, have a white skin color or a yellow skin color or or whatever. You, Alexandra, are the biggest racist of all. Oh, Julia, she does. She does. But listen, I am in such great company. I love it. How old is WikiLink? I mean, I don't the, know. I don't know. The last geez. time I heard about WikiLinks was Slender Man, which is a made up serial killer that children talk about. But Alexandra is very involved in her wiki pages. Definitely, Kristen. She, she's well, Kristen, very, she despises who she is. She's she hates very, it. Listen, don't hang out with miserable people. Because they, in turn, will just, you know how it, like, rubs off on you? Somebody's in a bad mood, and all of a sudden you feel funky. And I'm not talking about funky, like, between Alexander's <coughs> legs. I'm talking about you just, you feel like <coughs> ick. <coughs> Surround yourself with happy people. An alien, it's called mental illness. You know, I mean, I mean, it's it's so. Uh, what is the guy's? Uh, if Amber's still in here, she knows. Um, Donnie, what is his last name? Donnie Long. What is it? Donnie Long. Long. Okay. All right. So, um, he did two eye-opening videos on Alexandra, and um. Yeah, it's it's pretty bad. Flowers, I will. But you know, the, the, the crazy thing is, though, is that, like, Sue is younger than me, and Sue is prettier than me. So, and Sue is probably smarter than me. So, of course, Alexandra's going to go after her. And ladies, every one of you, even if you don't like Rick, Know for a fact that Alexandra has the hots for Rick Bastuba. You all know it. 
women's intuition don't tell me you ladies don't know you know you can't blame her ah uh, purple buds i'm sorry to hear that i'd probably scare the shit out of you then it's so funny though barb when when i i i've only caught snippets of her stuff i refuse to watch her i've never watched Literally, <clears throat> I've never watched more than 10 minutes of Alexandria, whatever the fuck. I've never oh, watched more the, the, Listen, the dramatics absolutely freaking kill me. I had, uh, my best friend was over here last night and Alexandra was going off talking like this. Uh, I think so. Yeah. And, um, she, she goes, what's the hell with this one? And I'm like, just continue to watch her. She's like, Jesus Christ, she's fucking crazy. I'm like, it doesn't take long. It doesn't take long for people to see it. You know, yeah. I mean, we're just used to her being, you know, miserable and whatever. And listen, you guys, Miss Parker is a rock star. Okay. And you all know it. She is a rock star. And believe me, the woman doesn't lie. She is freaking incredible. Anybody who saw those videos that she did, the deep dive that she did on Alexandra, oh my God. Well, Alexandra was so mad that she that she had YouTube take them down because they were too accurate. Absolutely, Tia. Absolutely. You know, Alexandra was talking about the increase in her vitamins last night. And all I could think of was, you know, the woman is not on an, on any antipsychotics. There's no way that her mental illness is being managed. I mean, no. I'm not even a mental health counselor, and I recognize that. And I know that there's people in this community that are in the mental health field. They've already... They've already given me the FYI on Alexandra. Hey, Barb, you want to see something cool? Mm-hmm. So, you know, years ago, my buddy bought Joyce Jilson's storage unit. And for you people that don't know, Joyce Jilson was the number one astrologer for... L.A. and for Ronald and Nancy Reagan, she was the number one astrologer in the world in the 80s. <clears throat> this is her original book from her storage unit. Yeah, I remember you were telling me about that. And, you know, the funny thing is I'm not really into astrology, um, but the, the, thing about, um, the thing about her is that she actually – in, in the Reagan administration, she created a lot of credibility for astrology. Yeah. Oh, and guys, I want to I want to mention one more thing about um, Wicca witchcraft, and uh, then I need to get ready for bed here because I've got an early morning. But um, I want you guys to remember, and I'm not anti religion. I'm just anti-organized religion. I'm, I'm more of a spiritual person. But just remember that the incense that the witches use, right? The Catholic Church borrowed paganism. The cross that is the symbol that the Christians use, it is, again, a form of symbolism. Everything goes back. If you, And I am not dissing the Catholic Church or the Christian Church or the Jewish synagogue on anything I love learning about religion. I love it. I did my Paganism. thesis on Mormonism. I love it. Paganism. But the theology is great. But the Paganism is. But, but true pagans don't consider it a religion. They consider it a life choice. Very much like Judaism, right. Mountain Man. Very right. much like, like Judy, Jewish people... A lot of Jewish people, especially if they are, um, you know, 
I can't remember it now, conservative and upwards. Um, Judaism is a, is a life choice, a life lifestyle for them. <laughs> so anyway, if anybody, oh, Tommy James is in here. Dude, I feel so sorry for you. I really do. The smell must have been terrible when you were with her. I, I do feel sorry for you. I, to I would to love to something. see Rick. I would I would love to see Rick do an interview with you, Tommy. I really would. I'm going I, th to. I think that you've got I know that the the owls don't want to hear it, but I think that you know you have some some stories to tell and I mean, I'm here to listen, and I know a lot of other people are too. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah, so, what we'll do, Tommy, what we'll do before we leave, you know, in the next few days, let's hook up and we'll have Tommy on. And we'll have Tommy I think that talk. Would be great. About, we'll have Tommy talk about his time in Houston, what, what happened. Um, We'll ask him if his dick fell off, if it turned green, did he get a shot? <laughs> Poor um, guy. And we'll ask him, and we'll ask Tommy the straight truth. Like, what, what happened? Because, you know, she can lie all she wants. But, you know, here's the thing. This is the way you guys that I look at it. When you have me and people like Barb and Flowers and people like Tia and Rocky and Tommy and Purple Bud, and we all say the same story, same scenario, about three or four people, you guys know more than I do. You guys been following that piece of shit for five, six years. When I started jumping into her, looking at a bunch of stuff, she has been race baiting white hating calling people supremacists for like 10 oh, I years i haven't known her for that long i i've only known her for a little over a year speaking of rocky though i did want to tell you rocky i'm glad that you unblocked me um i really enjoyed your live um and i think that you should do more of them i i thought it was great I really did. So listen, I'm going to let you go again. I'm going to, I'm going to put my um, IG in the chat as soon as I get off here. Um, and then I'm going to head off to bed. But if anybody has any questions for me, as far as anything, feel free to DM me. And if you guys like the idea of me doing a separate IG strictly for, you know, talking about, Paganism, anything like that, learning how to do certain things. Let me know. I'd be I'd be glad to do that for you, and I won't charge you. So, all right, Rick. I'll talk to you probably after work tomorrow. Give Sue my love and chat. It was uh, it was great chatting with you. Thanks, Barb, for clearing all right. Up, uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks, Barb. See Bye. You. All right. Okay, guys. Um, guys, I, I thought that, um, you know, you could get Barb's perspective. Um, you know, it wasn't Barb ranting. She was explaining stuff. Um, <clears throat> and then for us, you guys, you know, you get a better view of, um, like, how Carissa – fucks with people, how Alexandria and her dumbass, how she fucks with people. And then she thinks because she makes a stupid fucking uh, dumbass wiki page about us. Fuck, fuck all that. Go real life. Because she goes real life. That's real life, right? Once she opened a book and they started talking about me and my kid, when when my son went to the police station and told them that he was kind of scared. Yeah, they took notice. And you guys, let me tell you what else went down. Because this is stuff that Alexandria and Carissa, Controller, whatever the fuck you call her, 
what they don't understand. Since Alexandria's made threats and calls people racist and talks all this shit about people and people might might be waiting for you and all that shit, right, Alexandria? Because that's what you said. They got her photo at Middlesex County Court. They have three pictures of Alexandria and the fact that she's threatened people, number one. She's threatened to spit on people and she's hurt their threat. So the bit has wherever the fuck she is. She's got a hot because he knows that bitch ain't sticking her head nowhere. None of them motherfuckers are coming to Jersey. Not one of them. They're going to talk tough behind a fucking screen. They're going to come in here, hide behind fake-ass fucking account. Because that's what they do. Do you know why? Because that's all they can do. Because, let's speak truth again, guys. We're all adults. I own my own home. Can't fuck with me. It's mine. I own my own business. Can't fuck with me. It's mine. Everything that Sue does, you can't fuck with her. It's hers. So, like little kids, they resort to calling me fat, call me short, call Sue ugly. Wow. Ooh, that hurts. But I bet all you guys, a thousand dollars, Not one of them motherfuckers is going to come to Jersey and not one of them is going to get like that in my face. None of you guys will. Not fucking one. And you can talk and you can say, oh, he's fat. I'm going to fat your fucking ass because you won't do it. You know why? Because you fucking can't. Some things you guys are just untouchable. Okay. Okay. Barb is cool. It can't fucking do shit. So Alex, it thinks she's doing Carissa a favor. She's making it worse because now, Alexandria, pay attention. You got fucking dick in your ear, you sick fucking bitch. You made it worse for Controlla by mentioning her name mentioning my name and saying all this hateful shit, you made it worse for her. Now you have the court and their eyes are open. They have photos of you. You ain't going anyways because the broke bitch you couldn't afford to go. That's number one. Number two, I'd almost guarantee you guys, Carissa got that phone call that I've been telling you guys about. Guarantee you, I cross my legs when I when I sit down. Um, I guarantee you, she got that phone call. Carissa knows what phone call I'm talking about. Now, the broad, the only thing Control has ever told the truth about is that her name is actually Carissa Tabona. It's the only fucking thing she's ever told the truth about. That fucking broad lies. Her mother-in-law, Tina, hates her. Says she's a junkie. Her friends are junkie. Anybody she associates with, fucking junkie. That's why Tina has nothing to do with her. And Charles was a junkie. Her father-in-law was a fucking junkie. Mr. Because he works for the New York Tran, wow, that'd be a shame if he got fired. She thinks the union's going to back his ass. Yeah, okay. You'll see, bitch. Alexandra creates these fantasies. She calls them visions of grandeur on us. I don't have visions of grandeur. If I tell you guys something, it is. Is it a big deal? Nope. I paid my house off. It ain't a big deal. I'm proud of it. I'm 52 with no bills, normal bills. Yeah, that's a lot more than them fuckers will ever be able to say. 
Here's two things. Carissa, excuse me, will never own anything. Alexandria got sued for $166,000. Is that her mother-in-law in her chat? No, Rusty, fuck no. They won't go and control his chat. They fucking hate her. Mm -mm. But she got sued for $166,000. Let me tell you what happened when you get a... Um, when you sue somebody and you win. Once you get a default judgment, pay attention, um, Alexandra, and then call me a liar, bitch, and then we'll really expose your ass. When you get a default judgment against you and you get sued, they could go after your taxes. They could go after your car. They could put a lien on your fucking house for the amount. She got sued by Jennifer Randaza for 166000 Alexandria lost. She's in the rearage because she begs for money. She was out there going, yeah, I need money. I'm broke. Oh, I can't do this no more. Because she's fucked. She'll never have a job. She'll never have a career. She'll never have an income at 44 years old. You're right. You're welcome, Rusty. That's just how it is. That's facts. That's visions of grandeur to think that singing, cooking, dancing, sucking, whatever you do is going to get you nothing. It's going to get you nickel and dimes. Let me show you how Alexandria is. This is Alexandria. Yeah, Michelle, so since that car is Gary's and under his insurance, don't want a policy to have. When they get sued, and if there ain't enough to cover on the insurance, what do you go after? You go after cash or you go after real estate? They could say no, but it's a fucking fact. It's a fact. Listen, you could deny that shit till the cows come home. And guys, let's be honest. Just because Alexandria Controller says one thing, oh, all of a sudden it's fact? What about the shit dropping her kid off at the park? You guys all saw it. She fucking lies. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Really? Because you said it when they fucking watched you. Oh, of course she does, Rusty. But she used to fuck Gary. That's why. That's why. Let me show you something. This is this is going to be Alexandria and Carissa in a couple years. Sorry, bro, I'm all out, man. Man, I got these cheeseburgers, man. I want the cheeseburgers. Please, man. I suck your dick. <laughs> Get out of here, man. Get out of here. That's both of them. Look at that. I want the cheeseburgers. That's that is Carissa and Alexandria. Both of them. I played the little video when you here, yeah, I'll play it with you in oh, a minute. I, right I suck your dick, man. She's the type that it blow you a fucking Big Mac. When the bitch don't laugh. <laughs> when she's broke. You guys think about it. She's 44. She's okay. failed at everything. She has two things going for her. A smelly pussy. No, I'm being serious. <laughs> She's got that. She has two things going for her, and the fucking broad can't even do it. Two things she's got going for her in this world. 
One, she's black, and two, she's a woman. She's a black woman. A black woman in society can go get a job before Sue because of quotas. It's a proven statistical fact, yet she can't even get it. Could you see, exactly, Inex, could you see Alexandria at McDonald's? Hello. Good evening. Could I take your order? Would you like a reach around the counter? Shit. Would you like your dick sucked? It's only an extra $15. Help a sister out. Whoever she prays to, they told me to tell you that if I suck you, I can have 15 more dollars. That's her. How about Walmart? Hi there. My name is Alexandria. Welcome to Walmart. Would you like to get fucked and have a better shopping experience? How about my friend Controller? What the fuck do you want? You want paper and plastic, fucking bitch? <laughs> then she acts like Towley. <laughs> That's the melody to Funky Town. So you got one that wants to suck dicks for cheeseburgers, right? Alexandria. You got another one. Hold on a minute. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Taking pictures. So. Oh. Yeah. Okay, guys. Here's controller. This one's controller. That was that was Alexandria. Here's controller. Just so we get high. I know I can remember if I get high. Oh god damn it. All right, fine. Here's your stupid lighter. Hold on. Wait a second. That's it? Yeah, that's the melody of Funky Town. Don't you kick me down? To Funky Town! No, tally the entry code. Because she's so stoned. Can't remember shit. It's like, that's the melody of Funky Town. Yeah, because the bitch is so fucked. Methadone. Dude, you guys, let me show you something. Okay? This is what's bullshit. This motherfucker's going on a t-shirt. Now, you need to be stoned to watch this? Well, let me do you a favor, you stupid fuck. Go fuck yourself. You tell me that guzzling that methadone in a fucking car driving. Alexandria, you're okay with that. D Lynn, you're okay with this fucking bitch guzzling, guzzling fucking drugs down while she's driving. But that's okay, right? Oh, yeah. Let me tell you this, you guys. That picture's going on that t shirt. You don't like New Jersey courts? <laughs> hey, Aaron. Uh, he's a little out there. Let me tell you this, though. Them pictures went to the fucking detective because they're showing a pattern for controller. Why? Rusty, I have no idea, dude. I, I'm going to tell you straight up. I didn't even know what methadone was. I had to Google it. I don't do drugs. I'm fucking worked up hyper enough. I don't need drugs. But they got that picture. So she's coming out of the methadone clinic, guzzling the shit in the car. Now, since controller wants to be a fucking smart ass, since D Lynn wants to be a fucking smart ass. Since Alexandria wants to be a fucking piece of shit. 
when I go to the methadone clinic, when I go to the methadone clinic and I show that picture of her and shit in the car, I'm going to cause so much fucking ruckus for them fucking people. And then on top of it, Sue's been in connected here, Alexandria, because of you, you fucking cunt, with the news. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, they want to know about this. Maybe it's time when we go to Stanton Island, we show them pictures and maybe me and Sue will be on the fucking five o'clock news about why the methadone clinic listen method alexandria this is because you're a fucking piece of shit they want to know why somebody's coming out of there and guzzling the shit in the fucking court or in the court in the car Mm -hmm. the court is trying to stack and show a pattern the day of the accident till now. And she's still doing this shit. She's got that piece of shit in Houston, Houston, threatening motherfuckers. That's going to make you shit. Do I remember Biddy? Yeah, I remember Biddy. Oh, oh my God. Biddy, that fucking dingbat. Her and her sister doing all the scams. Yeah, I remember Biddy. I also remember that fat pig telling people that I threatened her kids. Never talked about her kids one time. Yeah, LOL, exactly. Now, Mr. LOL, you're one of the only ones I think that you need to uh, send me an IG on IG. I'm going to forward you, LOL. You can You can show, um, you can send her stuff too. They want all this stuff because it shows a pattern. You want to say something? You're going to hang out? Yeah. Um, yes, we're, listen, you guys, Italy for life, yo. I'll say one thing. That's right. Italiano, go ahead. No. Talk some shit. No, I'm just gonna say Italiano. one thing because I'm I'm busy working right now. I'm like you dimwits. Who you got it, LOL. Who do nothing? We're just not gonna talk anymore about what we're doing or what's going on behind the scenes. Just, you're gonna see. You're just gonna see. You're just gonna see. Keep running your mouths about us. Keep making up lies about us. Keep talking about family. Keep doing what you need to do to make you sleep better at night. We'll still have a great life while you're still miserable. Yeah, Don't but the care. problem is. Susan, yeah. I bet you both of them so-called women sleep upside down. So what the fuck? You don't sleep anyways. You guys sleep upside They're down. Disgusting. But Alexandria, you're big ass. Thank you, Tia. You're jealous. I told you, you fuck with me. I'm fucking with her. Mm-hmm. When they nail her ass mm-hmm. and they cut her off of the methadone, she gets to blame you. We have nowhere else to go, Alex. Don't come apologizing to us like you do with everybody else. I make sauce. But I'm telling you. you, I'm sorry. I'm I'm telling you, because you have a habit where you attack people and then you apologize to them. Don't come apologize to us. We want nothing to do with you because of what you're doing. You don't know us. You are a very sad person. You have no life. You have nothing. You are absolutely on assistance through the state. We did find everything out about you. Yeah, you're a fucking liar. You are in Houston. EBT for life. You go back and forth between your dad's apartment and one of the Airbnbs. That's going to stop. When he stays at his boyfriend's. Right. Right. Um, You're not a We're going to fix that. You're a crazy bitch. Oh, we're going to fix that. Yeah. Yeah, We're going to fix it. You've been I'll doing, make. I'm sorry. I'm gonna make sure your ass is homeless. Bitch. You've been doing this for oh, yeah. so long to everybody, to so many people. Mm-mm, not anymore, honey. And you know what's odd? And you so, don't like it because I'm. We're standing up to you, and I'm standing up to you. I know all your little secrets, all the fucking bullshit that you do to other people. Bitch, sit your nasty ass down. You, you're nothing. You're your little body. weaky. Links. What do you get garbage. more people in there when you're you're, you're oh, making your videos? Oh, D Lynn. Woo, D Lynn. Woo, girl. I'm so D Lynn, you're okay with that pig 
threatening people, and you're also okay with Carissa doing all that. But I'll tell you this. Here's a little FYI for you, little red. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you somebody who's not okay with it anymore, freaking the sheets. Oh, one of Controller's main Zordi, money. She fucking high bolted and she was in here. You know why? Because Freak is sick and tired of Carissa stalking and fucking harassing. And you know what did it for her? The fucking cancer comment. Mm -hmm. You know why? Because poor Freak is dealing with it. The poor woman is dealing with it. You know she's dealing with it. And yet, Carissa, your punk ass piece of shit thought it was fucking funny. Mm -hmm. Guess what, bitch? When Stanton Island, when Staten Island cuts your fucking ass off of meth, no, I'm gonna rain such a fucking hell on them motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. They ain't gonna give nobody nothing. Nothing. Your ass is gonna be cut off. How's the CVS going? Oh. Did you clean your house yet? Not CPS, CVS. Oh, well, I'm here in CPS. Not, well, CPS. CPS was at your house last week, bro. Did you find a housekeeper yet? Yeah. Hmm. And you just keep on. Lazy ass. All them pictures, they're getting ready to fucking butt fuck you. Your life's about to oh, be I know, by the courts. So. Um, Aaron, I don't know what happened to Liz. Oh, Liz laughing love. She, she, she comes in here, goes there, comes in here. But freak. Was her friend. But until she started. You're you, disgusting. Control your life is going to change once you're in that courtroom. You're not getting it. Your control is winning nothing. Oh, she's you're, gonna win you're a one-way ticket. Get slammed by the court. It's not a joke. No, and you guys you can know you can call us liars. You call everybody liars. You can say it's not happening. Okay. There's no warrant out for his arrest anywhere. Everything's been checked and verified, you fucking moron. You're so stupid. Oh, and there's no Officer DeMille. There's no lead detective. And you're not calling anybody on him when you're sitting in court because your phone's not even allowed in the courtroom. You and you it. sure the fuck ain't bringing no army you because no army. let me tell you what you did do, Controller Carissa, you fucking asshole. That video when you said fist the cuffs, hands and feet, motherfuckers and all that shit, and then the armies and bear spray. That was all went to the detective. Yeah. And guess who listened to it? The detective and the prosecutor. Mm -hmm. Two angry women. And I want you to say, oh no, they didn't, or you don't know what mm -hmm. you're talking about. I want you, Alex, to say, I'm full of shit. I want you to say, Sue's full of shit. Because when the when the new the new let me tell you something, the Staten Island fucking news. Oh yeah, Aaron, probably when the Staten Island news heard that people are coming out of the hospital and guzzling methadone in the car, oh they want the story. Mm -hmm. I'm not giving nobody shit on the phone. I told the reporter, we'll see you. Mm -hmm. Guess what, Alex? When she gets cut off, it's because of your fucking stupid black ass. Because you're nothing but a racist fucking pig. You race bait. Mm -hmm. You say everybody's fucking white supremacist. You're the biggest racist of all. But you have a Dago and a fucking Jew together. You're going to fucking see. And just so little FYI for you fucking dumbass. Oh, wait, wait. And There's... she said, wait, because I sit on your lap, I'm controlled. Bitch, you don't control my ass. I just sit there and I take it all in and I'm listening and I observe. This right. fucking girly right here does what she wants. Yeah, no one's going to tell me what to do. She does what she wants and how she wants. Mm -hmm. Okay? Fuck you, Alex. You don't nasty, let the pretty face fool you. Dirty, disgusting whore. You're jealous. You ain't got because nobody. you don't have this. You're like um, mm -mm. you're like what we call a masquerade. You hide behind a fucking mask or a face. Simon, what's up? Masquerade. You, you know masquerade. why? You don't look because good, you're fake as fuck way. and you hide. But I can tell you this: they should have did themselves a favor, Michelle, and left us alone. Mm -hmm. But they want to push my fucking ass 
pushes back harder. So mm-hmm. fuck you, fuck your whole family. When I get done with your ass, no more methadone for you, bitch. No. And you get to blame Alexandria because she's oh, she's wonderful. Wow. He's, he's my leader, Alexander. Isn't that what you call the bitch don't, leader? We don't have leaders. A leader. We're well, the leader of the country. This is what you call a team. She does stuff. I do stuff. I have my own friends. She has her own friends. We go out for dinner and drinks. Friends together. My friends. Her friends. They all know each other. You're a wacko. Oh, wow. Do they go for dinner, drinks, and dates? Couldn't be. And then people knew me from the radio. Oh, even so. But I know. Sue's got the same friends. She was 15. I got the same friends since a couple of them. I was 12 and I'm 52. What we don't do is air our shit out. You people, Mm -mm. not you guys, flowers and you cool people in LL. You people see what you want to see. You see my office. That's all. You're mad and you have to create exactly. false have fantasies and stories you have nothing. because you got nothing on her. So you got to call her ugly. Mm. Sue's been called everything but ugly. Mm. Say her hair's fake. Say her blue eyes are fake. Wow. Double D's. Yeah, well, mm. can't say much about that one. <laughs> but other than that, look at her skin. Look at the freckles. Are you enjoying this, Alex? Because I know you're stalking watching us. You can't help it, Alex, can you, you psycho bitch? Oh, I do end it, Flowers. And like I told all you guys, fuck all you. Because it's going to be my turn. When we get the lights shut out in Georgia, ha-ha, so to speak, methadone clinic, Mm -hmm. they're going to can your ass like tuna. Mm -hmm. You get to tell Alexandra, wow, bitch, thank you. You should have listened to Dragonflies. Mm -hmm. Even though she's a fucking dumbass. Wham! Push that bitch down a hill. Woo! Hang on, motherfucker, for a ride. Sue is lovely. Thank you. Flowers is from Manchester. Oh, okay. okay. You know, that's over there. Mm -hmm. When we go to the news, bitch, Mm -hmm. and let me tell you, Carissa and Alexandra, pay attention, because this is what you did. It's all going to be stat. Your ass is going to court, going to get mm-hmm. bucked fucked. Mm-hmm. No, owls are here. What's up, Scully boy? What up? When you're fucking ass, mm-hmm. then you're going to have CPS crawling in your ass. Mm-hmm. Now you're going to have no methadone. You're going to have no methadone. And she's going to say, leave me alone. I'm a no methadone. Mm-hmm. They're going to stack more on your fucking ass and at court. Don't forget, schools are... Uh... No drug zone. No drug zone, bitch. So we're, we're going to make sure they know all about mommy control that drives on the parking lot. And the Hi. news the news told her, do you have proof? Mm-hmm. And Susan was like, mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, they wanted to see it. Controller, what would the PTA think of you after this? The fucking PTA. They'd spit on that bitch's face. You're a disgrace. Here's your word. Disgrazia. Yeah, I saw that. Remember Janice and Richie when they were fighting? Guess who Sue got to hang out with? Remember Janice from The Sopranos? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ida is a little... Ada, I mean. She's awesome. Ada's a little, uh, Ada's a little off, but she was sweet. Mm-hmm. We got Very to nice. hang out with her. Very nice. Person. Oh, that's right, because my buddy was in the movie Goodfellas. That's right. All them motherfuckers know that shit. Oh, yeah, that's right. Italian guy loves his redheads. <laughs> Skelly, I hope you're having a good weekend, bro. But. So, Controller, again, what, what should I wear to court next week, girlfriend? Or in a week, girlfriend? Should I make sure my hair is all full? Oh, she's going to look so good. Mm-hmm. Judge is going to stop going, damn. Mm-hmm. Who's that redhead? Mm-hmm. Continue. I'd be scared of the judge if I were you. You better be afraid of that judge because that. She is a black woman, and I read a whole lot about her. 
she don't fucking so play. alex you can't call it racist day you can't say yeah. the judge is racist yeah alex your favorite word what are you gonna do when they can her ass like tuna she's a black woman and i'll tell you one thing she came from probate let me explain something to you when judges come from probate mm -hmm. the day they get transferred to probate they put their resignation in to move. Now she's in superior court. Okay? Guess what she gets to deal with? With your fucking ass. Child neglect. She was doing that for years in probate. And they fucking hate it. You know why? Because they got to make decisions about taking children away and sending bitches like you in jail where you belong. Mm -hmm. So now... Mm -hmm. You got three women against you. Prosecutor, lead prosecutor, woman, lead detective, woman, fucking judge, woman. They got it all. And guess who you get to thank for everything that's coming down? You get to thank your fucking pal D Lynn, you fucking pig. Maybe no. this is saying you are about Folsom Prison because we're coming at you hard with proof and facts, and the court and the judicial system has nothing to do with the hospital methadone. And a fucking news reporter that we already talked to. They're going to butt fuck you three ways to sunshine. And they're going to be like, hey, boo, how's your ass feeling? And you're going to be like, well, I haven't been picking on me. And then, Alex, you could go on your stupid rant. Go attack some. You could yeah. be like, well, guys, I want everybody to know. She's Controller neither. got butt fucked in court. By a black woman. Mm. Yes, yeah, Simon, she's mixed. I'm going to tell you what. Let Controller's fat ass go in front of that African-American judge and say, Hold up, judge. Hold up, motherfucker. Shh, I'm part you. Yeah. Bitch don't even know what she Here's is. what happens with these tough guys. You act tough like you street crud, street rat, right? You go and jack a motherfucker. You're going to be a pussy kitten. As soon as you walk in that court, you're going to be like this. Oh, I'd be scared. I don't give a fuck. She, oh, of course she's going to leave her rusty. Of course she's going to leave her yeah, ass. Will go on to somebody else to stop. Trust me, guys, 10 more minutes, man. We're going to end this Um, because it's, it's 10 o'clock. We've been riding for three hours. Let me tell you something. Yeah, she did nothing wrong. That's why she's got child neglect, second degree. Guys, I'm going to say it again. Look at Alan laughing his ass off. Let me say this again so everybody's crystal clear. Alex has got too much cum in her fucking ears. She can't listen. So I'm going to explain it so her dumb ass can hear. Second degree child neglect is mm -hmm. prison. Three to five guaranteed with your past it's guaranteed i spoke to two high profile lawyers in jersey and let me tell you something controller why i fucking did that you ready for a zinger ask me why sue why go ahead and say why 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 the fuck would you do that rick why the fuck would you do that rick i'm gonna tell you why conflict of interest the two main Lawyers in Jersey can't take your case now. I did that shit on it. Do you have any Batman? All right, I, I got Adam West up, Burt Ward, George Barris. Oh, fuck yeah, I do. Good. I'm, sorry. I'm just going to make this clear. She ain't saying nothing no more. I'm not saying anything, but I'm just.
just going to say, you can sit here and you can live in denial and you can say we're making up all the stuff and everything that's going on. Mr. LOL. And who we speak to and everything we do is lie. You've tried everything to keep us away from us finding out the truth, other people finding out the truth. Obviously, I mean, you know there's a problem when you got to make up some court candle or some stupid shit you were doing, burning a court candle or something. Obviously. That voodoo shit don't voodoo, work with the judge. It doesn't. Hoodoo? I said voodoo. Hoodoo? Voodoo. Voodoo. Hoodoo. Voodoo. Voodoo. And you know what? I don't know. Maybe you going to jail for a while. Yes, Alan. Listen, maybe you going to a jail for a while is going to fucking wake your ass up that there's not a game out there. You really think so? I don't know. Or you're going to or you're going to get worse, you're going to overdose. It's going to go either way because you're a mess. Your kid has no chance with you as a mother because you're a horrible mother and that's just the way it is. And I'm done talking about this. I'm done. You can try your threats. You can try to bring families into everything you've been trying. None of it's working. Maybe grunge. We will be there a week from tomorrow. And that's just the way it's going to be. Everything we said that. is the truth. We've talked to the detectives. We've talked to your local police department. You can call us liars. You can say we don't know what you're talking about. You can sit here and say, oh, he, he does harassment and he's got warrants out. It's all lies. All of it's a lie. Try to call... But try to call the two top tier lawyers in Jersey. As soon as you tell them their name, they can't take your case. Conflict of interest because I already told them shit. And be prepared Sorry. that the lady you hurt in the accident is probably going to be. And she's going to sue your ass. going to be there. And maybe they'll take Gary's house in Boca. It's not a joke what you did. It's not a joke at all. You are your worst enemy. She'll hire Saul. You did this. You did this. When you get. When you get your methadone taken away, she's an advocate now. She's mad. Mm -hmm. When I go there, I tell that hospital how motherfucking fucking motherfucking dare you people give that sick bitch methadone, show them the picture saying she's driving around with kid in a car like a pinball machine. Fuck you people. And then we're going to the news. And I'm going to make this clear to you again, you fucking bitch. Stop saying we want your child, that I want your kid. She is a hypochondriac. I don't want your child. Damn. We do not want your child. We just want your daughter to be safe. And Big for the record. fucking difference. For the record. And I'm going to say this on my video, which I don't need to, but I'm going to. P122, Staten Island Police Department, on a recorded call, has me stating... Nobody's going to her house and nobody's touching that fucking kid. No one's going Number to her one. school. Neither. Number two, the lead detective of Middlesex County. I told her nobody's going to that mm -hmm. school and nobody's going to that house. I don't need to go to your scumbag house and nobody needs to go to a child's school. No. But since they want to be assholes, not just to me, but other the people, people that called, it's going way above their head. And one thing, control way me, above their you head. You gotta understand, there have been lots of people. You just want to pinpoint us. Oh, yeah, because, grunge. You no, know, you just want to pinpoint us because of the videos and stuff and us going live, but you don't realize how many people have made calls on you, send videos on you, everything. We're just a small little amount of it. If you really knew how yeah, many rusty. people hated you, that's why your mods were giving away your info. People are so fed up with you. That's just the way it is. You are a very hated woman online. And you have lots of people that would love to see justice and, come. And. And that's the truth. So, but if you want to keep blaming us and make your life easier, blame us for everything. But like I said, we're just a small little amount of it. There's oh, my God. You there's guys a lot of people doing things behind the scenes that control you. You wouldn't even know what to think about. So I'm out of here. Oh, yeah, Adam. Because I got to go do stuff. But. Bitch, you're fucked in court. We from tomorrow. You only have you to blame. She's more than you fucked. can blame us Not all just you court. want. Blame us for everything. There's other people out here that have called your daughter's school. There's lots of people that have called CPS. There's Maybe a list a of people. Lot of people what? that have sent videos in. To who? Who'd they send them to? Detectives. Prosecutor. Oh, the lead detective that you said doesn't exist, except I know. One, two, three, four, five others mm -hmm. than me. Mm -hmm. That sent him shit was talking. 
the lead detective, when she called me, she's bombarded. She was on vacay, came back, bam, had all this and stuff. it's not only us, but you want to keep blaming us? Go right ahead. You have no if clue. you only knew who was doing stuff. And. With people you wouldn't even expect. And. Somebody reached out to me that's going after you because they can't stand Alexandria. You don't understand. You made it worse for yourself involving Alex. Grunge, listen, she won't be able to use um, weed because. You get drug tested. No, she won't be able to use that. She's already been on probation. Yeah, you can't do any of that. She got away with stuff. And I'm going to tell you guys something. Okay, guess what, Simon? Gary better get her a good lawyer. But I can tell you this. Gary's going to lose his house. Controller better be listening. The top two lawyers in New Jersey, she can't fucking use them because I already told them about the case and other stuff. It's a conflict of interest. She can't use Gary's pee when they put her in the bathroom and take a piss. Exactly, Adam. He will have to put a lien. Mm -hmm. But since the people hate Alexandria and your buddies with her, now they're working with us to go at, you have no clue who's pulling strings. <laughs> Alexandria said, I'm all talk. If you only knew We're just bullshitting on here. You have no idea what's going down, but you're going to see it soon mm -hmm. enough. Exactly. Grunge. Control is better off to go to jail because if she got felony probation, First of all, she'd get five years probation. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't use Alexandria's pee. Rocky said she'll use her pee. Shit. Man, if she used her pee, they'd be like, oh, shit, control is dying of AIDS. But, guys, we're going to we're gonna just go for another minute. It's 10 o'clock. Um, I just say, yeah, I have AIDS. But guys, I'm going to say this to you again. If you guys like, I know Adam, but if you guys like this, there's my cash app, the cash app money. And thank you for all the, the donations. The cash app money is for New Jersey. We're buying all you guys that come down dinner and drinks. Um, But I can tell you this, Trippy. Yeah, I love birds. Thanks. LOL, reach out to me, and, I, and I'm going to send you info tomorrow because we we got a couple things. We, we got some big business coming up. We're going to tie up loose ends. But, guys, Cash App, that's, that's for all you guys, dinner, drinks, and everything. But I can promise you guys, fireworks. And it ain't going to be at court, but it could be. Yeah, definitely, LOL. Rusty, thank you. But, guys, that's the Cash App. Like, share, subscribe, Alan. Thanks, buddy. Um, you guys have no clue. And I'm going to say it again. I told you motherfuckers to leave me alone. I'm not playing fair. Oh, Rusty, you guys, please like the scream. Thank, scream. Stream. I told you guys, don't fuck with me. I don't have filters. And I won't fucking stop. And if you fucking don't think I'll travel, you're out of your fucking mind. I'll travel to Houston like I give a fuck. I went to Florida. I don't give a fuck. I'll go to Jersey. I don't give a fuck. The fuck? Man, you're a gold sticker. I don't give a fuck. I told you, motherfucker, stop talking about me. You can't. I told you to stop talking about my son in cancer. You fucking can't. So fuck you. Fuck your family. And you know what, Carissa? You want to get Gary involved? You want to get that pussy child senior involved? Oh, I'm more than happy to accommodate. I'm reading the shit right now. Okay. Alex. So Alex, this was just sent to me. You decided to to take to task legally a white supremacist group who is not only stalking and harassing me but who's fabricating lies about me designed to incite 
It's physical violence against me, against me that could lead to someone attempting to kill me. You're fucking out of your damn mind. <laughs> Go ahead, pussy. The legal battle will be pricey, so I'm requesting donations via Cash App to Alexander Myers. Oh, she's going to scam you guys out of money. Now, good to know, now Alex. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're not white supremacists. First of you're all, a racist hold on bitch. now I'll tell you what we're going to do, Alexandria. We're going to get a hold of the top five Houston attorney. Sure Go ahead, bitch. You couldn't get enough money to get a retainer for that. Everything we have is, is right here about you trying to screw your nephew and everything. It's not made up. You're a piece of shit. You ain't doing dick. You ain't doing nothing. All you're going to do is get control of his ass in a lot of deep shit. And when she doesn't get her methadone and everything else. But guess what, Alexandria? Your threats you're the only one our garbage. You're the only one Nobody's going to give you money. What are you no. going to get? 30 bucks? So you can go buy something or drink something. We're not done with you, bitch. Off the scumbag. And there's so many people after you, Alexandria. That's why you have to hide That has out. nothing to do with us. That's why nothing. you hide out. You should see all the messages we get about you. People that have been fucking with mm -hmm. you, waiting for years. Mm -hmm. You're a piece of shit. You can do what you think. Have your lawyer call 1-800-GO-FUCK-YOUR-MOTHER. Fuck you, Alex. <clears throat> Guys, there's the real cash app. Nobody's doing nothing. Like I said, if you guys, um, um, sorry, if you guys want to see fireworks, they don't have a clue, you guys. I'm not telling her shit, Rusty. She don't have a clue. I'm just going to do what I got to do. She don't understand how the real world works. It's not what you know. It's what you can prove. I'll get done with Houston attorneys. Of course, you don't want to go to prison grudge. But I'm going to tell you guys, bottom line, and then we'll cut it because we've been on for three hours. And, man, I appreciate all you guys. Let me tell you what Carissa and that sad, sorry, piece of dog shit Alexandria don't understand. She's being charged with child neglect. Automatic prison. It's automatic because she has such a past. And for the record, guys, robbery three, duct tape held him down. Fuck yeah, her past is violent. Why do you think the bitch can't get a job? You know why Alexandria can't get any money? Because she lost, she's got a default judgment against her for 166000 Any of you people give her a dime, you'll lose it. She can't get a job because her checks will go to restitution. This is how dumb she is. She thinks we're all fucking stunats like we're dumb. You fucked your own life up, Alexandria, and you got to lay in that fucking disgusted, infected bed. You fucked your family up. Now you fucking control his life up because you're a piece of shit. Yeah, Rusty, she don't have nothing. She can't. Why is Alex getting involved, Aaron? Because she thinks she's helping control her like a badass. She ain't doing shit. She's a fucking pussy. She's not going to Jersey. She ain't doing shit. She likes to post all that little Reddit bullshit like, oh, oh, help me. Ain't nobody coming to you, bitch. You've cried wolf for five fucking eight years. Fuck you. When controller gets fucked in the ass by court, by the hospital, by the news, by everybody, you get to blame your pal, Alexandria. Now I'm not stopping. I'm not going to fucking sleep. Oh, Rusty, I think she hates controlling. She's digging a hole for her. Her people have told her to stop. Nope. So go fuck yourself. Guys, there's a cash app. Please consider donating. It's for um, New Jersey fireworks. Like, subscribe, share. Get this. Yeah, you do get burned. 
They're they're hey, I told these motherfuckers I'm not the same. I'm not like any of them bastards. I fucking do what I say. Fuck you. You want to talk about my son with cancer? Fuck you and fuck your family. You want to threaten Sue? Fuck you, fuck your family. You think you're going to be hardcore badass with me? Fuck you, try it. Any of you motherfuckers, I'll be in Jersey. I won't be hard to miss. I'll be at Middlesex County Courthouse, Superior Courthouse. Fucking try me. It's all you got to do. Come get it. Alexandria, you just fucked up by telling everybody what you're doing, dumb fuck. Because I'll make sure no top lawyer in Houston can take your dumb fucking racist pig ass. You can try white supremacy shit. Does it work? Sorry. I'm Italian, remember? I'm not white. Remember that. According to you people, I'm not white. Olive olio, right? Olive skin, they call it olive olio. Yeah. Fuck you. I haven't even started yet. D. Lynn, we ain't even started on you, pig. I told you to shut the fuck up. You should have listened to Dragonfly. Freaking the sheets did. Freak did. And you guys send a prayer out for freaking the sheets. She's going through some difficult stuff. Freak is another one who confided in the controller only to get fucked in the ass. Poor woman's going through enough with her and her family and and medical issues. And controller's over there fucking dissing people with cancer. You'll see. You think? That's all I can say, guys. Jennifer Rodriguez, Alex is Netflix. Hold on, guys. Oh, Jennifer, they have a shit ton in common. Here's Netflix. <laughs> I know I'm such a fat neck. Yeah, fat neck. Yeah, flowers. Olive oil, exactly. Guys, I want to thank all you guys for riding on a blissful, cool ass Saturday or Sunday. Sunday. Cash App, Rick Mastuba. I want you guys to all have a good night. Um, wherever you are, wherever you are. Morning, noon, and night. The fuck? When Freak came back, control and try. Yeah, Jennifer, when she came back. But now she left. You know why Freak left? The fucking cancer comment about my child. Oh, Freak was very upset. Guess what? Controller didn't care. Freak can come here. She's protected. She knows how I feel, and I know what she's going through. These fucking pieces of shit like Alex, they don't care because they take, and they take, and they take, and they bleed you dry, and they're just like a prostitute. They go right to the next job. Alexandria knows she was a prostitute. She was a call girl. Fucking Miss Parker called her out. Got booted from Vegas. Stinky crotch. Discharge coming out of her. Not to be graphic, fucking truth. Let her deny it. She's got fucking hives, you guys. She's got HIV. That's why she won't show blood work. She got shit can out of the industry because she wouldn't take the test. And I'm going to leave you guys with this. I told you motherfuckers to leave me alone. Jennifer, I'm not sure. Be totally honest with you. But she told me. Freak told me because Freak was in here. Oh, she did tell Controller, yeah. Jennifer, I have no clue, but I, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you guys this. My opinion, Controller got that phone call. And I told her she's gonna get a phone call. Yes, Jennifer, she's got AIDS. It's been listen, it's been widely talked about for years online. Fucking years. Miss Parker called her out because she booked a sex party in Vegas. 
This is honest to God truth. Miss Parker already fucking acknowledged it and admitted it was true. Alexandria got removed from a sexual party because she had a discharge coming out of her and she stunk. That's truth. Dance around it, say it's not true, but she doesn't show proof. I'm keeping my motherfucking mouth shut and I'm going to show all you motherfuckers what we're doing. Oh, yeah. She fucked up. And poor freak gets caught in the crossfire because Chris, listen, Chris can't keep friends. She has no friends. You know why? Because only druggies and scumbag ghetto fuckers like Alexandria would actually listen to her. Yeah, Rusty. Of course it does. She's a fucking liar. She's an absolute. She's an absolute liar. And anybody that looks at you. That you don't know if they're looking at you. The fuck. That tells a story. But you guys listen. She's been outed for years. How the fuck. Do you get booted out of the porn industry? All you got to do is lay down, fuck, suck, and make money. She got booted. Then when they offered her the AIDS test and all that, she wouldn't do it, and she got booted. She went to Vegas, flown out there, Miss Parker. Hey, Alexandria, come out, yeah. They fucking booted her. She should be scared of me, not Miss Parker. That fuck should be scared of my fucking ass. Not Miss Parker. I'd pay her to take a blood test. That bitch ain't got no money. She's got an EBT card at best. She goes from Airbnb. That's already being tracked. Where she goes. And when I'm done with that bitch, you'll never get a fucking Airbnb. You'll be hightailing the fuck out of there. When I'm done with your ass. And when the people get done with Ivan. It's all she wrote, bitch. You wanted this. You started this by fucking with me and fucking with my family. Making threats. Telling me I'm all this and that. Okay. We're going to fucking see who does the fucking. We're going to see. Guys. All you guys. Have a fantastic Sunday night. Prepare yourself for Monday. Um, we're going to go live again before we head out. Please consider cash app and we'll take care of everybody down there. Um, oh, of course, Jennifer. Fuck yes, she is. She's a piece of shit. But it's okay. She was warned to stop and walk away. She can't. Well, it's my turn. It's my fucking turn. It's my fucking turn. And I don't play fucking nice, motherfuckers. I'm just going to leave you got that. Everybody have a fantastic night. Like, subscribe, share. If you're not subscribed to this channel, you should probably ask yourself, Jesus Christ, why ain't I subscribed? Yes, Jennifer, yes. And then she goes and says that her parents... Alexandria's parents were fucking grooming pedophiles. She fucking admitted it, and I got it, and we'll show that too. Everybody, Melissa, Jennifer, Flowers, Grunge, Rusty, Michelle, Barb, Ronnie, all you fucking people, Art by Michelle, Alan, LOL, Trippy, all you guys, Simon, everybody, thank you. Thanks for spending your Sunday with us. You, you guys know we appreciate you. Trisha, everybody, Rocky, Scully, go fuck yourself, buddy. Um, prayers for Freak. Freaks, welcome here. You guys watch fireworks. The fucking shit's going down now. After we, we got a couple phone calls back, same to you, LOL. When since we got a couple phone calls we were waiting for back.
Can you say deep doo-doo? Love you guys. Everybody have a fantastic night. See you soon. Love to everybody. Alexandria, Carissa, and your family. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Motherfucker.